<laughs> if you're watching the replay, if they're if you can watch the replay, feel blessed. But then that did that mean we didn't have a good time? No, is there didn't. going to be a replay though? We don't know. No, just because there's a replay doesn't mean that we don't have a good time. It just oh, means no, that's not that, that's not the point. I'm saying that when the five of us get together, if the other two show up, yeah, gonna go down. Fast. I mean, it's dangerous just with y'all too. So. First of all, whoa, this <laughs> lander is so unnecessary. <laughs> we are fine, upstanding, upstanding yes. law abiding yes. citizens. Quite. Yes. Of course. Yes. Hello. Hello, friends. If you're watching the replay, hey, what's popping? How you doing? Did you make a cocktail to rewatch this mess? I don't know what you're going to get. I really don't. Um, and let's say hi to everyone in the chat. Hey, hey bye. friends. Bye. Look at all you beautiful people. How is everyone? It's Friday. We made it through the week. I have an exciting announcement, but I'm going to wait a little bit before I tell everybody. Ah! The reason for these sprints. Good evening, beautiful. Hi. Hey. Hey, hey, Paco. Oh, at least the last hour because you always at work. You're always at work. Lord. I mean, I appreciate the hustle, but I'm like, damn, let Paco rest. <laughs> Hey, hey. Oh, hey, Bri. Hi. What are y'all doing? Does anyone have a cocktail and an adult beverage? I made a marg. I right, started drinking it. Ray, what do you got? Um, okay, so you know that thing I sent Robin in the jar? Yes. Yeah, I had one. It was called Brunch Punch. I put rum in it, and then I mixed it with a, it's like a passion fruit seltzer or something. I don't know. Oh, that sounds delicious. Cheers. Robin, what you doing? That <laughs> water? Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, me too. Imagine I got some. Full of just liquor. Hydrated baddies. Yes. Oh, that would be dangerous if you <laughs> just <Imagine. like> straight <laughs> my tequila. Yeah. It's yeah. possible. <laughs> you already know. It's like sipping. <laughs> Not a bad idea if you're going to work, though. Just for anyone who maybe <laughs> maybe you only use the 24 ounce one. That seems like a better idea. Maybe not a 32 or 40 at work. You know, like uh, how bad is your job? <laughs> Did you have to drive there? Question. Right. <laughs> if you're taking the train or subway, then maybe <laughs> we could talk about it. Because I definitely, you know, want to drink. Oh, happy yes. is. Friday. Oh, yes. Treat yourself. Don't deny yes. yourself. Hi, yes. Isabella. Oh, and John okay. number two. I got you, Brie. I'll make you an, I'll make another one just for you. Oh, perfect. Yep. Do it. Job number two. That's what hey. we're doing. This is true. <laughs> um, I will tell you in a moment. <laughs> it's like the people are all here. You know? Yes. And hopefully Ashley is supposed to join us a little bit later. And then Bree's probably like out on the town and then she'll see my text yes, and she'll yes. be like, oh my God, I forgot. So hopefully we'll be briefed with her presence. Yeah. Ashley is probably going to come on around 830. That's usually. That's yeah. Yeah. And then I feel like Bree is at the gym. <laughs> yeah. You know what? Well, she don't respect the gym hustle. Get it. Get it popping. I told you, Robin, it's me. Bree gets it. Hot girls don't rest. I told you after you get your hot girl walk in. Oh yeah, let me see. Oh, where yeah. are you at? Um, I'm only at sixty five hundred, but that's decent. I didn't walk on my walking pad today. I only did two Nigel walks, and then, well, like I walked. I went to go get my pizza, and then I went to the grocery store. But that's good. Strawberry milkshake. Mm. I haven't had a milkshake. I, I, tomorrow is me. <gasps> I should have got you some brownie mix at the store. God damn. Nigel, did you not do that? It is. It is. Thank you. Some of us may be celebrating <gasps> early. I Ooh. will celebrate tomorrow. Who could that be? I don't know. What kind of ice cream? Facts. Brady, oh. getting it. No, you're a trainer. Three miles. Oh, just water, which is what your body needs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. As a no, water supporter. No. I love this for you. <laughs> Where are we at on your list of supporting? So water, <laughs> pasta. Oh, yeah. She's a soup she's a ally. Oh yes, a soup and pasta. 
Uh-huh, uh-huh. Big Valentina ally. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, amen. I support that because I got what pizza. Order. Hi. Hey. Oh, oh not you creeping. So I creep. You reading the story? Are you and Brie reading Baby Girl the story? Is that where y'all at? A Baja Blast. Oh, splash of whiskey. Oh. <laughs> mm. Reading the Night oh, Tiger. Oh, oh yes, books. What are those? Are y'all reading anything? <laughs> are y'all reading anything? Or actually, there probably maybe might be you possibly an obligatory sprint. One sprint tonight. I'm not going to be reading because I finished a book earlier. But what has anyone read a really good book recently? Uh, I would love to hear about it. I just finished a uh, Beast of Ruin. Which I'm buddy. Well, I was buddy reading with Alana. I, I left her, but it was <laughs> it was good. It was good. And so Steph and I are buddy reading the Night Swim right now. We're having a very successful buddy read, and I'm about to come in and break that up. <laughs> Why did we do that? Is the Night Swim a, a th- mystery? Yeah, really? Yeah, and it has like a podcast element. Okay, I think um, I think I read that one. And then I started home going yesterday. Oh, Ooh, I like that one. I have her. I have the other one. Transcendent K- Kingdom. Yes. Oh, I read that this year. Which one? Transcendent Kingdom. Oh no, that didn't sound good. You said oh. I feel like okay. most people like Home Going better. So it's very they're very different. Yeah. Books. It's- Robin, I said let's talk about books we enjoyed. Okay, keeping the energy well, high. Heard- well, I'm trying to keep you enjoying books, so. <laughs> I mean, it's not getting read anytime soon. <laughs> it's not on my horizon. <laughs> I have a long list of things ahead of that. But I did get it. Oh, the audio. Are you listening to the audio? Or... I, I mean, I have the physical book, but uh, someone told me to listen to the audio, so I got it. And it's nice. What for is the night swim about? Um, so it's a woman who runs a podcast, and she is... So it's a murder, true crime podcast. Usually she does murder cases, but for this season, she's covering a rape trial. And while she's in the town, there's someone who's sending her letters about a a case that happened like years ago, like her sister went missing or something. Um, And so we're like following the girl who's writing the letters and the podcaster and getting podcast episodes. Oh yeah, I think I did read that one. I thought you did. It's it might have been a, a few a couple years ago. Starting your master's. Oh, congratulations. congratulations. That's amazing. I want to do a degree, but I don't want to do the, I don't want to get a job afterwards. I just want to learn the things and then do Why another not? one. I Boy. need to get to my certification. I keep forgetting that I am really I'm like, am I allowed to do that to yeah. not pay my student loans? No. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. You're absolutely allowed to do that. Okay, because I look, I got a long list of degrees I'd like to pursue. Ooh, mm, okay, so funny. Oh, oh my god, this is my next read. Ah, I'm so excited. Rocky Road and Mint Chocolate Chip Gelati Ooh. with Vanilla Custard. Mm. Untethered Time, this is how you lose. So many people, oh, I felt that I wanted to love how this is how you lose the time more, but I felt like I didn't know how to read when I was reading it. Wonderful. So yeah. I, g- I gave that up. Oops. Plain bad heroines, not like other girls. Ooh. Hmm. I don't know if I've heard of that one. The Elementals, Southern Gothic Horror, and I'm obsessed. Mm. Gothic, not for me, but I love that for you. Oh, okay. Per? Yeah. The Night nice Swan is good. Hey, hey. Legend Born. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. I love that you loved it. I love it. You said, mm-hmm. have you seen like the TikToks of the girls like when mm. <laughs> when women have when women have podcasts and it's just- oh, oh, oh yeah. mm-hmm. uh-huh. yes. <laughs> Among thieves, Among Thieves, so much fun. Book lovers. Oh, oh, I just the one that you were uh, happy place. I'm not reading book lovers, but I did just finish Happy Place. Oh, which one did you like? I liked Beach Read. I did like Happy Place, but yes, if you hate mm. Silver Nitrate, don't tell me. Mm. That's Silver Moreno Garcia, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. And she has another book coming out in 
Why? Well, Education and Malice was so good. I'm glad you love the Hurricane Wars. And SVU episode in the book. Yes. yes. Hey. Hey, Robin. Oh, I need to read that one. Hi, Alices. Alices. Oh, what manga? Strange the Dreamer. That one. I, have I ever read Muse of Nightmares? No, but <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I read and finished Strange Dream and loved it. And then I went to Star Muse of Nightmares. And I don't I didn't get that far. And I don't remember why, but I didn't finish it. But I don't know if I would like Strange the Dreamer, so I've avoided it like the plague. I don't I don't know. feel like no. Or I love it. <laughs> River of Silver. Oh my God, that would be fun to listen to. Facts. Oh, I love that. Ooh, mac and cheese. By Jay Bree. <gasps> okay, I gotta make. I gotta do further research because here's my thing: is like, <clears throat> I would love to get a degree in like anthropology, specific forensic anthropology, psychology. African American studies, like masters or a PhD, but like I don't want to do a job. Like I don't, I don't want to go apply it. I don't want to go in a field. I just want to have the thing so randomly someone could be, and I'll be like, actually, I know. You just want to be like Brie and have five degrees. <laughs> yeah, basically, my idol. I'm trying to be like, and now, because you know the language thing. Mm -hmm. So I need to come back to that. Me too. Okay. Every day I get a damn notification and I'm like, oh, I can't do Duolingo though. That fucking app. Oh no. From another app. Yeah. It's, it is, Duolingo, I'm like, why are you harassing me? Literally. It's like, harassment. Duolingo is going through something, okay? I, I need to, like, I want to know, but I kind of don't want to know because what is going on, honey? Yeah, <laughs> They'd be like, I know. <laughs> when the moon hatched. Ooh, I've seen that one around. Ooh, three at once. Hey, look at the doggy. You don't plan on reading either. Yeah, what's that? Read for yourself. <laughs> I'm ready with a book. What book? What you got? I mean, I got a book, but we meet on vacation. Oh. Mm. Are you vlogging? Oh my God. It's a variation of a vlog. What do I mean? Okay. I'm vlogging and I hate myself already for all of the fucking clips that I have. You didn't Four aunties in a wedding. Well, I've been uploading it, but editing it, no. Oh, <laughs> I have the clips all in order, but oh, like half the battle. That is, you the know, only way I can vlog. I need to edit as I go. Right, <sighs> you are a very structured person. Yeah, you're talking. This is going to be like a. This is going to be not aesthetically pleasing as Olivia, but it's going to be about like an hour. So this is it's a lot of. I hate myself already, but That's I committed. Why. And I've got one more book to read for it, and I'll be finished. The Viscount Who Loved Me, Tempest of Tea, and Summer Girl. Oh, you guys reading everything. <laughs> All the things. Ooh, that sounds cute. Oh, yes. Uh, Are either of y'all going to read that one? No. Fuck no. I'm waiting on some reviews. <laughs> nah, Leah and I broke up. We broke up. We, we're done. Oh, my God. I want to read Dr. Shivago because I love the movie. Oh my God. <laughs> we had to watch it randomly in like seventh grade or something. And I was so surprised by the drama, the heartache, the love. The... I've always wanted to read it. A Blaze. Oh, I want to read that one. Give it another chance. I really love the audiobook of Strange to Dreamer. Maybe that owl is going through some things. Ragged. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Does anyone ask the owl if they are potentially going through withdrawal? You know. <laughs> <laughs> I fear you put yourself in a room for about a week with a VHS, mm -hmm. and some pizza, like, and maybe it's... no one has, maybe no one's done that for him. Mm -hmm. Maybe you need to email them and let them know. Mandarin, I'm impressed. I told myself I was going to learn French. <sighs> well, French. Well, and then I was like, maybe I'll try German. Still haven't. I... I'm supposed to be learning Spanish. Oh, I'm supposed yeah. to be learning Italian. 
<sighs> There's just so much to do every day. <sighs> I just I need I just need to re-download an app. What did you have before? Uh Babel. This is the way things should well, I have Babel. I have never used Babel. I liked it. Do you have to pay for it? Yeah, I have to pay for it. That's okay. the thing. I don't want to pay for something. Oh, I feel oh, that. Oh. That was how I felt about the Abby Jimenez uh, just for the summer. I was like, I don't want to wait 12 weeks. I want it now. Right now. Because I'm in a romance mood right now. Right now. Did you check script? I don't want to listen to it on audio. Oh, the orange duo and then it changed to the melting fish duo. Duolingo. Yeah, duo. I don't know why they I don't I why I don't know why they do this thing. Like I don't know what it is. Why was he orange? See, this is how you know that that, that was him showing the sickness he was going through. <laughs> is this is it withdrawal? Did we diagnose it? Did you did you call it? <laughs> what were you on? Hey, oh the, I I wanted to read this one. What? Let me hold on. Wow. I gotta wake up at 2 a.m. Central to take my fear and gum. You a good friend. Wow. Yeah, because I'm like, I gotta get up that early for you to go run. That's crazy. Bless yeah. you. Bless you. Mmm. Wait, that's really happening, the third book? What do they need a third book for? It like is like on Goodreads and she's announced it, but I don't think there's like a timeline for when it's supposed to come out. And yeah. I think when I had finished Crooked Kingdom, which was like, I don't know, 2017, I was like, yeah. And now I'm like, no. Well, here's the thing. Like, when you, <laughs> if you finish Rule of Wolves, there's definitely room for more because Zoya says something like, tell Kaz Brecker X, Y, Z. So it's setting oh. it up, but at the same time, I just I'm so I'm still pissed at her for King of Scars. Which is valid. I haven't read Rule of Wolves for that reason, because I'm like, nope. No, I was talking, I was actually talking to Steph about this the other day because I I feel like I have many Roman empires, but Rule of Wolves is definitely one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Things that happened that we never circle back to. It never made sense. There's something that happened yeah, at the end and everyone's just it. like, oh, okay. Like, we're not going to ask questions? No. Now no, I'm mad know. because if she does a third six of crows, fuck. Um, now see, Here's a solution. <laughs> 90 day fiance the other way. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't like it's, I think she's definitely talked about it before, like on Instagram, it's on Goodreads, but I don't know if there's like a concrete when it's supposed to come out. Yeah. And so, hmm, hmm. <gasps> I'm just not gonna look at that, I'm gonna skip. Skip. Sorry. Don't do it. I think you should try it. There are books that I know I can't go back and reread because when I read them was at a special time and I don't want to go back and like distort that memory that I have of them and Six of Crows and Crooked Kingdom are in there. Also I like mean, Akamath, I held in high esteem when I read it. Can't speak I do, that. I'm not going back. <laughs> I'm not really I haven't read Six of Crows and Crooked Kingdom and I still, I mean... I still Blah. like them, so I have no problem rereading them, but Oh, that's good. Yeah. No, this oh. is why I, I think this is why I don't reread because I'm afraid that I'm gonna go back and it's, it's not possible. gonna be as it's great. always a risk. Sometimes it's just as great, sometimes it's better. Because but then it's also good. well, so I'm rereading um a song of ice and fire because I'm reading it with Monet. It's her first time, but like Monet! Okay. And I'm having a good old hee-haw. Like, I'm liking people even, Jeff, are you having a conniption? Existential crisis right now. <laughs> Jessica. Can you see me? No. Oh, okay. I was kicking my feet and I, I knocked my, <laughs> unplugged my camera. So I have to, I have to go under the desk and replug it. I'm so sorry. Keep 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 carrying on. 
I don't remember what we were talking about. Entertain the people. Hold on. I'm I'm trying. I don't remember what we were talking about. Leave our Hmm. Her. Mm. What are you doing, Ray? You look like you're so... I'm, I'm responding to Elise. Okay, well, I'll just respond out loud. So Elise Hayes was like, how are you offended when you had a whole epic breakup? I still love Six of Crows. Six of Crows holds up. Does that change the fact that Lee Bardugo was on my worst of three times in one year? No. <laughs> Shout out to y'all for helping me remember because my memory is shit. But yes, I was reading, I am reading A Song of Ice and Fire and I am loving it on- Oh, right. How far are y'all? We're only on the second book, but I'm having a good old time. I love it. I am just like, man, I really love Cersei. And I forgot. I mean, I didn't forget because you can't forget that kind of love. But like, man, she's great. You do love a villain. I love a villain. You're back. Woo, who's the villain we love? Cersei. Oh, I didn't read that. But you oh, I am absolutely not reading the familiar. Oh, you meant, sorry, I thought you were talking about the Greek retelling, retelling not Game of Thrones. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. <laughs> My bad. I have reread some of Game of Thrones, but like, I can't do it again, George. I can't. No, because I'm like, we're going to get to the end of this, and then what? We're just sitting here. Nothing. Waiting. For two books. Oh, y'all waiting on two books? Yes, it's Winds of Winter and like a song for summer Wait, or season title, for summer. No. Yep. Yep. That's funny. Because every year, <clears throat> excuse me, if you look up at like popular books coming out, every year Patrick Rothfuss third book is on that list and Winds of Winter is on that list. <laughs> Never. <laughs> There's never a date, but there are names for. I'm gonna see what I forgot what the seventh one's I, called. I, I DNF name of the wind. So I haven't. I have oh, it, but I haven't read did. it. Hmm? You officially DNF'd? Yeah. Okay, the winds of winter, and then a dream of spring. A dream of what? Spring. 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 That will just, I guess, never see. I can't do George R. R. Martin. I tried. Um, something by him and it put me in a month long reading slump. How could he do that? That's funny. I um, could do it. Books you won't read. Yeah. Uh -huh. You're not reading the familiar. Uh -huh. I don't, he, That's there'll fine. be articles that keep coming out every few months. It'll talk about him writing it. He'll post a blog or something. And so he still pretends like he's going to, he's not a spring chicken. No. Um, Holy <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing over. So the fourth, the last book came out in like 2011. I think. And I didn't read them till 2014, I think. And I remember I was in a half price books looking for some copies because I just had random paperbacks. So I was trying to make the match. And this other older man was looking at the same books. He had to be maybe in his 50s, uh, late 40s. But he was like, I just hope that he finished the series before I die. And that just sticks with me because I'm like, that man is still waiting. That was 10 years Almost 10 years ago. Whoa. That man hopefully is still alive and waiting. I, I hope so. <laughs> um, I, think you get, I think you get they're the same type of villainous, but you get a little bit more into like what Cersei is thinking hmm. and her motives for things. Interesting. Because isn't Patrick, because like, okay, Patrick Rothfuss just be playing games and streaming. George R. R. Martin is just doing whatever. He's hobnobbing with celebrities. Literally. Oh, yeah. um, then who else, now, I, a series I want to read, but I don't want to start because it's not finished, is the <sighs> Gentleman Bastard series, because that author, like, suffers it's with depression. Seven. No, it's supposed to be like seven books. There's three. Oh. So I'm like, I'm going to wait. I've been burned. I can't do it. I can't do it. I hear it's great, and I feel like I would like it, but that's why you don't read white man fantasy. <laughs> uh -uh, because 
Michael J. Sullivan was he's really doing something. I mean, right or right, whatever is good. Yeah, we gotta finish that, Robin. Actually, I know. I'm waiting on you. Okay, Anna, I will help you. We will next three months. What? We have buddy reads for the next three months. We go. I've never hey. read we couldn't cancel before. <laughs> I mean, we have good books picked out. What do y'all have picked out? I don't even know. We're reading. Reading. See, she don't even know. We got Sword of Kai again next week, next month. <gasps> I'm so excited. Ashley! Ashley! <laughs> Ashley! <laughs> hey, friend! Are you, are you drinking or consuming something? You said it my what? Drinking <laughs> or consuming something. I'm relaxed. Okay. That's all that matters. Do you like a sympathetic or understandable villain in a book or evil for the sake of being evil? Oh, I love evil for the sake of being yes, evil. Yes, you do. Yes, you be I like understanding because not like un like not like understanding of other people, but like there's a valid re there's a reason. I'm like, you know what? I can see, I can see here why you're like this. I, I get like, it. I can see why you feel. Yeah, like you know. I, no, you know, I was Thanos like, correct in his execution? No, but like I, no, at a point. but you know, <laughs> <still> like that. <laughs> but I need a little bit of an explanation. I don't, but you know, so you like a mustache twirling villain? Yes, I just want someone to be like, you know what? I don't like your face today. <laughs> End of the world for <laughs> Fuck them, cause that's why. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, okay. Interesting. The mustache trailer is fun. And that's what we care about. Relaxation is Friday. Amen. Well, I don't know if Brie is going to appear, if we, we may be graced by her I presence. She probably forgot. <laughs> She's at the gym. Maybe. Um, He moved to Santa Fe? Who's in Santa Fe? I don't know. Wait, what? I don't know. I'm confused. Anyway, I'm glad you're all here tonight because we're here to celebrate something great. Yes. Make and I just want to tell you all that I have suffered greatly since moving back to this wretched country. And while I'm still in the United States of America, today I am freed from the shackles of employment because I am officially unemployed because I quit my fucking job. Oh, Jesus. That's it. That's the... <laughs> I had a I had a I had a later timeline and then they wanted to act stupid so I moved it up and I was like today's my last day. I'm so happy for you. As cousin Evelyn of the internet says, if well, I'm gonna call it fun employment, so maybe it can trick my brain into not being anxious. That's not going to work, but I'm gonna say it anyway. <laughs> I mean, have you tried? <laughs> I've been saying it today. Speaking of Jess's unemployment, if y'all aren't a part of her Patreon, you can be. You should be oh, wow. in Owens Town. We're a wonderful community. Oh, <laughs> thank you, thank you, Ray. Thank you. We I'm have like, fun. Uh, we what get is this complete? content. We get sprints, weekday sprints. Only pans. Only pans. That's coming. Oh my God. If you don't know what only pans are, join the Patreon because it's worth it. <laughs> oh. that's the only reason that you should join right there. Only pans. <laughs> And OnlyPants is indeed a play on OnlyFans. It's not explicit, but I am not. I am fully clothed <laughs> while baking. Please let that be known. That <laughs> seems unsanitary. <laughs> I wish I could quit my job, man. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh God. Yes. Praise. So that's it. All the love. I want to, for some reason, I want to say that's the tweet. It's not a tweet. But <laughs> that is it. It no, that is not it. it don't downplay. It. It's a great thing. It's yes. wonderful. Truly. You need to be freed of that wretched city. <laughs> um, Tia, why you do that? Don't do that. Don't, don't, don't do that. Aren't we though? Thank you, Lisa. Aren't we? Well, sometimes I am a C word, but it depends on the <laughs> <laughs> C word. Only a one letter difference. 
<laughs> oh, Ray, have you used this feature yet? It, they literally just announced it like yesterday. Mm. I uh, I know I need to get it. Uh, I just don't want to. Uh, yeah, I am still in higher ed and it's still trash. I hate it so much. Well, oh, I hate it for you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I know. That's why I put it off for trash. so long. Trash! It's so trash. Listen, I, I, I used to work for the current senior vice president. I texted him and asked him to fire me, and he said, "No one's getting fired." I said, "That's a lie. People are going to get fired. This happens every other year. I've been here for six years. I know. <laughs> I am giving you the you, We got to make budget cuts anyway. Cut me. <laughs> Cut me. Yeah, the. The market, anytime I see TikToks, I'm just like, I, I, I hate it so much, but I hated working more. So <laughs> I paid, you know, our things, our things paid off. Obviously not my house, but you know, my fence, my appliances, my credit card bill. So mm. oh. <laughs> no, Ray is saying, let me go. Begging. Fire me. Fire me. <laughs> oh elementary education. Mm. Yes. I feel like I would rather work with elementary kids than... My sister teaches third grade or second grade, but she is like one of those few people that I know that like from a young age is always like, I want to work with kids. I want to be a teacher. And she would work at, she worked at a daycare, summer camp. She loves children. I'm like, don't get it. But she teaches second or third grade. I can't remember which one. And she loves it. Um, And I'm like, I love that for you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and our family group chat, my mom was like, how does it feel to be the only one to have <laughs> is doing something they enjoy? <laughs> Triple it. Tri what I see with these, what these parents are doing on social media Triple. and like, Triple it. Truly. What? So I've heard, cause like also Angela works in like higher ed. What's like the big, What's like one thing that's really bad about it? Well, the pay? Thing, so like for my institution specifically, we have constantly, like I've said, I've been there for six years and every other year we like are in a financial crisis. We're a shitload of money in debt. Nothing makes sense. We need to cut, um, I believe it was six to eight million on the admin side. However, we're also in the process of merging with another school. So how that makes sense, I don't know. Um, and like just like working in DEI specifically in higher ed is a fucking shit show. Like mm -hmm. I, my boss's boss, like shouldn't oversee our area because she doesn't understand what we do and why it's important because we're student facing and she's not, she's a formal faculty member. She doesn't understand how student centers operate or how they work. And like, she forced me, she made me write a proposal to go to the, um, I'm going to the Pennsylvania Black Conference on Higher Education, and she made me write a proposal on why it's beneficial to my role. And I'm like, I'm a Black higher education professional, and I run a center for Black culture. What do you mean? She just like, makes everything super difficult for no reason. Like, my supervisor is yes. currently in Germany for professional development, and she gave her a hard time about that, too. Uh, yeah, I can't do it. I can't. I ever. I always thought if I ever was some kind of academia, it would be like college. But uh, I don't have a master's, so that's it. not going to happen. But she like, and her students love her. Like at the end of last year, I think it was, they threw her because her birthday's in June. So you know, never when school is. It, it, but the, like the last week of school, they threw her like a surprise party. So they like decorated. They bought her gifts. They bought her desserts. Like she's she is a great teacher. Um, you know, one of those they'll probably remember when they're older. Like. But I feel like that's, I feel like there's a lot of teachers like that, but there a lot of them are leaving because of. They're underpaid and overworked. Yeah, everything. Same with higher ed. Yep. Um, uh, excellent question. I would love to know. Great question. <laughs> I don't know. Oh my God. What is your drink? Aw. Everything is crumbling. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Let's all go back to school. 
No. <laughs> I have, I'm currently, I'm currently getting two more certifications just because, cause I'm like, if I'm here and these are free, I might as well get something from y'all. But like, I don't, I don't need to get certified in HR and project management. I'm just doing it. <laughs> Not the hell no. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, fine. I'll go do that. Yes. You know how you're going back to school cause you want to learn things. I would like yeah. to know less things. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> well, see, here's the thing. I am not anywhere close to paying off that piece of paper that's still in the tube that they shipped it to me to after graduation. So I'm like, let me just get some other ones. <laughs> I took it out and I was like, that looks real nice. And I rolled it back up because, of course, then they're like, oh, do you want to get a frame for like an extra 300? No. So I put it right back in that tube. I think it's in the garage. I don't know. Uh, don't I only have a bachelor's? Wait a minute. Okay. What is your PhD in? Which is basically a high school diploma at this point. So I haven't gotten, I haven't done any like, actually, I like, I did one semester of a master's of library of science degree, and I was like, this is not for me. <laughs> <laughs> and I quit. <laughs> So, Ashley, let me tell you that I forgot what the name of the class was, but it was like, like the research part, like all of the like searches, like Boolean search, all the different like search and stuff. I was, because <laughs> I was like working full time and I would get off and I was like, oh my God, I go, my God, I don't want to do this. So yeah, I was like, you know what, maybe this is not just because I love reading, you know, because so many people are like, I love reading, let me be a librarian. It's so much more. It's so much more than that. I think, yeah. <gasps> the podcast. Oh, that is Kayu. Yes. I love that. <laughs> Everything's difficult for no reason. Facts. <laughs> it is a phenomenon. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> and I, am, do I want another degree or am I bored? Two Do degrees, I? <laughs> currently two certifications, getting two more certifications, have considered a second master's. I don't know. I'm bored. I don't know. What about a PhD? Fuck no. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Mine is literally in the in the envelope on my bedroom floor. Yes. <laughs> My mine is in the, yeah, mine is in the, at my at my mom's house. <laughs> I know I might as well send it to my mom. She she would actually hang it up. I'm not going to do anything with that thing. It looks pretty though, but <laughs> <sighs> are you gonna pay for it? Right. Because who's who's got the time? I feel like there was something I actually wanted to do a sprint for, and I can't remember what it was. It wasn't reading. <laughs> Editing? Film. Uh, uh, well, well, according to Robin, I have to have another cocktail before I can film my um my, my DNF rant about that stupid ass fucking book I DNF. I'm still so mad about it. What book? <laughs> um, what's it called? The Butch Butcher and Blackbird? Oh yeah. I just got my hold in for that. <laughs> well, I hope. You enjoy it. <laughs> Wait, Ashley, I would read that with you. You have it? No, but I can get it. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I would love, because this is, um, yeah, I await your thoughts on that one. Oh, but I look, before I look, because Ashley didn't, like, agree to that. <laughs> <She> just... <laughs> Do not bend. <laughs> Do not bend. <laughs> We love nice. this for you. Oh, yes. Hey. <laughs> I understand. Yeah. They make their diploma super fucking large, so you have to get a diploma frame from the bookstore, which I refuse to Yep, do. yep, mm -hmm. yep. My undergrad one wasn't, like, normal size. It was, like, a really... And I was like, I'm not... No. <laughs> I'm not framing that. All that no. daggone money. Um, chart to, like... $250. No. Which is crazy. The cost of frames in general, let's not, because it pisses me off. Oh, 
Paco, mm-hmm. I won't work to calm down for you, but we want the Kings to win. I only said it because Andrew's from Sacramento. I don't really care. <laughs> you know what? Higher education Supportive is a life. scam. It is. It is. And that's coming from someone who works. I just keep thinking about how much money we pay for those pieces of paper. <laughs> So much. <laughs> Literally, you need another one. Paper. <laughs> you need another one. Like, but, but, and we still can't afford to live. Nope. Nope. Look, I. Hey, get a degree. It'll open so many doors for you. Yeah. Where's the money? <laughs> That's how you're gonna be successful. And then now here we all are. So. <laughs> You get a job. Like, I got my master's and two certifications and then went to my boss's boss and I was like, so? And she was like, no. And I'm like, well, fuck you too. Like, what do you mean? What the? I, mm, I hate it so much. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, Robbie, <laughs> we have a lot to look forward to. <laughs> I'm because I can't get it out of my library. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just need, here's my thing. Yeah, I gotta look into this. I'm gonna be a professional student. What would I do first? I really would love a degree in forensic anthropology. And then not a job, though. I don't wanna do that. <laughs> Bree! Yeah, where you at, girl? You're supposed to be in here. <laughs> Did you not get my text? No, because it's funny because it's the hey y'all with the picture knowing she's supposed to. <laughs> Bree, hold on. I'm about to, hold on. Dang it. I thought it was going to, it's not going to show the thumbnail. Bree, you're, you're on the thumbnail. You're supposed to, supposed to be. You're on the thumbnail. Here. <laughs> Everything, it's just like. <laughs> the doors cemented close. <laughs> it's oh look! Oh wow! My God. Oh. Hello. Hello. We at the gym? Yeah. yeah I knew it. <laughs> I was at the gymnasium getting your lift on. I was like, "Well, let me text Bree because I don't think she's gonna remember." <laughs> no, no, I remember it. I was just at the gym. Okay. How was it? What'd you do? Did you swim? No, I just talked shit with Minnie and we, uh, she was like, get out of the car. They're going to put it together that every time you're late, it's because of me. Okay, that one time, Winnie was like, I will not be blamed for this. <laughs> Poor Winnie, don't drag. Don't drag down. <laughs> oh, Brie, we were just talking about how I want to be like you and go to school and get 17 degrees. Oh, um, my God. So... <laughs> Well, and we're just talking about how anthropology. I do have an anthropology degree, and my See? concentration was forensics. See, so we can talk about that if you let's, want. Let's do that. Let's. But we we're also just talking about how much of a scam it is, and how much we have paid people a piece of paper. Scam, <laughs> piece of paper. It's a scam because why did that paper cost me two hundred grand? That's yeah. insane. That's what I said insane. A fucking piece of paper. <laughs> So many of these I've seen, like on TikTok recently, of these different student housing being disgusting. Oh, it's terrible. It's like, a shit show. Excuse me? <laughs> you got these kids paying 40, 50, 60, 100K? Hello? The doors slammed Literally. in my face. Get your degree. Open yes. Where? Oh my God. <laughs> these, I'm like, you want, you want a master's degree? Cents. And they, five to seven years experience oh, to give me twenty dollars. I, I hate it when they like your pay rate will start off as twenty one dollars and thirty two cents. If you don't give me that fucking dollar, <laughs> <I'm going to laughs> <pay>. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> not metal. <laughs> five years. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Here's my thing. I wish I had realized that yours. You know, like, but. At least our generation, I feel like it was very much not like trades were looked at, but it was like because I was the first one, you know, to go to it was like you're going to college, you need a four year degree. Agreed. And so, sure, I mean, although I don't know, I don't think I could be an electrician, I'd probably get electrocuted. I don't think I would make a good plumber, welder, mm, no, cosmetology, never my thing. But I think <laughs> trades are great. Uh, 
<laughs> you just oh shit it on all your degrees. <laughs> it's just that, no. No, I'm just not skilled for any. I just think I'm just a very clumsy person. So I feel like a lot of trades are very like hand coordination, which I do not have. And I feel like I would be injured and maimed on the job quickly <laughs> and have to be out. Just gonna show up one day with. What a hand! <laughs> Look, I cut myself just in my hobby. I'd be slicing you my did. fingers. You did. And you cut yourself like twice in one week or some shit. And we were like, "Stop!" stop yeah. Oh, so I, res I, res I respect those. Uh, I respect them. Get it? I don't know how I go to the gym, but I go. Love it there. Cause you little boss. Mm, 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 I need mm. to be. I need to. I'm consistently inconsistent. As a boy, did you say 80k a semester, not a year? That's crazy. 80, 80 American, right? 80,000 pesos because U.S. doll hairs. My lord. Good for you for going. To I remember when I applied to. Oh, school. she said a year. It's a year. Still, that makes me heartburn. <laughs> Still, that's too much. Still insane. Because I remember when I applied to schools, I knew I could not afford. It was like, I think it was like George Washington in D.C. And I think back then it was like 50K a year. And I was like, ooh, that's not happening. Yeah. I didn't know <laughs> I'm smart enough. But also, money would have been a factor. To go to what did you say? I oh, said I did yeah, I didn't go to GW because I wasn't smart enough, but money definitely would have kept me out for sure. <laughs> I will say I applied to a lot of schools I got into, but you know, I also, I don't know, I applied to scholarships, but you know how you see kids now? It's like, they applied, they got 85 scholarships worth $4 million. I'm like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I was applying, but anyway, now I just owe the government all this money that they're not going to get. Because my thing is, why everybody else getting the email saying that they too long has been forgiven? And mine is still, <laughs> still there. there. Joseph, bang my line. What's I going on, brother? I, you know what? He need to stop them fucking ice cream cones. That's probably what's going to the budget. <laughs> you are really upset about these ice cream cones. <laughs> no, but every, every week it forgives another billion in student. And I log in and I don't see a goddamn dip in my balance <laughs> not a cent not five dollars i swear i'm like god why 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 did i have to go to a reputable institution because you know a lot of them are like low value i'm like god damn it i thought why? i was a high valued woman <laughs> <laughs> joseph cut me a break oh, give man. me something off brother no, come he, he didn't i didn't see a grand rising queen yet you none i didn't see it yet <laughs> this i just fucking <sighs> i just feel like i don't use it so can i return it can i at least get 50 percent off <laughs> <laughs> Like, you can have it back. <laughs> you can. I won't claim to be an alumna, alumna or nothing. I'll put that class ring in the drawer. I won't wear it. I won't wear. I won't rep a sweatshirt. Nothing. <laughs> Take it back. I ain't never got the home degree because I mean it wouldn't. It would be no different. I do. <laughs> Low vibrational <laughs> universe. <laughs> okay, I read this first and I was like, what the hell is going on? And then I went back to this Ooh. one saying that. <laughs> 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 Which is valid. Very, but first I was so confused. <laughs> I hate when I go into a bathroom and there's shit on the wall. How did we get here? Where did we get here? How did you get there? Oh, Why are you? <laughs> Sometimes you got to go, babes. You got to go. And you be like, this is a glory hole situation. I know what's happening here. I got to get out, you know? Well, so <laughs> much a replay. <laughs> They're very. I, why couldn't I go to a low vibrational university? No, I could be debt free. Low, low. Low, low. <laughs> 
no, 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 no. <laughs> me and my it's, we ain't vibing it's so depressing i'm like what do you mean i ain't got it financial hardship please back up off me yeah. <laughs> oh please when oh no. <laughs> <laughs> listen they can't find it oh my god <sighs> It's just like <laughs> I need to log in and nail that, and I want to say, "See, Grand Rising okay. Queen, we okay. have deducted your <laughs> loans by three grand." We need to go back to chaos, and not my <laughs> lovely blood lady. <laughs> <laughs> Together, I'm and really sorry. Uh, I came in with the chaos, but everybody should know me by now. Just know that I'm not okay. Wait, wait, wait. So, this <laughs> <laughs> was like, Who should I invite to spring? And Robin was like, Us, obviously. And then Robin, I think, said Brie. And then I was like, Brie and Ashley. And then she was like, Brie, Ashley, Ray, and Robin. It's gonna get private. <laughs> I've been, oh. I've been on my best. Listen, I be on. I come to live streams and I be because the person I've been on a live stream with most of anybody is Ashley. So I be on whatever she on, and she be on whatever I'm on, and that's literally that, that's why when she said Brie, I was like, "Well, you got to invite Ashley." Now. That's literally how it goes. Robin was like, "Do you want to actually have friends?" Or you want to have chaos? I'm like, Listen, clearly, we well, chaos. Well, whatever Ashley eating, shit, motherfucker. I want pig feet. I want hog nose. Don't do me like that. Don't do me like that. Oh my god, I haven't heard the term hog nose in so long. Or you didn't have, you know, pre your post gym snack, some fuel, it's protein. <laughs> Yeah, hold on, Bree. What did you eat today? <laughs> uh oh. What do you? I anything? Feel, okay, I don't want nobody to judge me. Too late. I went to Applebee's and I sat there and got a ribeye with some mm, steamed broccoli, you. and it was really good. <laughs> that is protein, and carbs, and fat. That is excellent. How do you like to have your steaks cooked? Medium well. Interesting. If There's you tell me you're a well done how do you person, wear, how do you eat yours? Or if that white man got you doing raw, run, sis. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I, I do. Love into it. <laughs> I, 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 I do. Put that on, on your list. list. If you, you don't your like it, or your down, fairy, right? sis, run. I, I do his steaks medium rare. You're delicious. Hey, that white man, y'all. We all collectively agree. Medium well? No, it's too much. It's too much. Medium well. Mm -hmm. medium well. Medium I mean, it is his fault, but I can't do medium well. That white man, he didn't have to do us like this. Listen, <laughs> walk from the mountain. Walk from the mountain. <laughs> Run if you need to, sis. Run. I can't. That's paying my bills now. Kathleen, see, one of your brethren. I love you too, but Kathleen, see, I told you. Thanks. 
exactly. That white they man got well too that's much. All right. That's all right. I'll <laughs> I guess now I'll let it slide and shit. Mm, fries and a frosty. Dang, I ain't had that combo in a while. Man, Wendy's. Mm. Oh, but as soon as I have a frosty, I must visit this chocolate <laughs> highway. Some call Hershey, but it's just not okay. Brie, I'm eating, man. Like, I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm ignore it, girl. Ignore uh, it. Actually, what are you eating? I'm nosy. I want to know. Hibachi. A cozy one. Oh. Listen, J. Cole said, don't save them. She don't want to be safe. Taco Bell. Wow. Wow, y'all eating good. What y'all eat today? I'm hungry. I ain't eating. Like, that was four or five hours ago. I had pizza. Yeah, three. Three. Yeah, you went to the gym yeah. and you haven't, you need to eat. You need a protein shake, a protein bar, some. Mm. Mm. Ooh, now sushi. I don't have a vehicle, so I can't go. I gotta what figure out something now. Right? Oh, I let Winnie use my car. Oh, um. <laughs> <laughs> Jinx Robin. <laughs> I find this as a compliment. Thank you. Yeah, Ooh, sushi. Yum, 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 yum. Nice, nice. What'd you get? You get some lemon pepper? Ooh, was it good? Wow, Garamond said they 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 like more rare, and I am also white. Speak up for your bedroom. You speak up your bedroom. Brush. Speak up. I know that's right. I had a medium. Well, what's a Wagyu burger? Wagyu beef. Mm -hmm. I hear it's good, but I only had it in ground beef form. It's very good. Oh. Yeah. I love a ribeye, man. I really do. Ribeyes are delish. I love a steak mm -hmm. with a potato. Mm. Mm. Mm, Jesus. <laughs> Listen, this is selective. Mm, because <laughs> you have, why do you have a steak with no potato? Why? <laughs> they just go together. They're meant to be. They're meant to be. I do like a steak, potato, Ooh, and asparagus mix. Mm. Lemon pepper and mango habanero. Ooh, spicy, oh, you spicy. like wet wings? No, ma'am. You only a dry rub? I love a dry rub. You don't I like that. We'll see wings? I don't want nothing wet. Unless I'm Hey, man, I know that's right. Hey, <laughs> man. But I need my wings drier <laughs> than the desert. When it comes to seasoning on top of it, I need the flavor to be there, but wet wings will piss me off. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. That's crazy. I want to try when I win the lottery. <laughs> Is it that expensive? Save your coin. Ooh, period. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Man, that just milk. sounds like a toilet situation. Oh, you still eating? Free. No, I'm done. Free. <laughs> Free. It is. All that cheese? cheese what? Hold on. Hot, 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 hot Cheeto air fried crab legs. What? What do you mean? It's like, on at a table. like you're crushing like your hot food. Cheetos and I see where we're rolling going. The I, crab. I don't think it's a good direction, but I see where we're going. So I look, this is high activity. So <laughs> put, just put a little green emoji in the chat. <laughs> it's a pre it's for your favorite day. You hear me? If tomorrow's your favorite day, mm -hmm. okay, in the chat, in a the hot chat. Cheeto air fried crab leg. Like, like so many questions. Did you uh, you take the crab meat out, right, and then roll it in the Cheeto? Yeah. See, you know how like. <laughs> no, Kathleen. No, Kathleen. No. Kathleen, I just need I need to you take the crab leg out of the shell, crush the hot Cheetos and cover and then fry Wait, it. You, so you've done this before. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Experience. This is like a regular Why, I, I, I don't know. I don't know about that. Why? No, wait, I, I have I, like, that combination. a regular occurrence because if so, your stomach is strong. <laughs> and, iron. 
iron stomach because I love me some crab legs, but hot Cheeto? Like, what is it sticking? Are you dipping it in butter and then dipping it in that? Do you have to dip it in like egg wash? Like, I need you to send me a picture to lock under the Cheetos. Send it to Brie on Instagram. I need you to send it to locked underscore bookition underscore because uh, uh, a girl like me needs to know. Swagoo. <laughs> <laughs> I am just, I am, I, wow. If you like it, I love it for you. I don't. Any, do anyone think that Wagyu <laughs> sounds like an ad lib from Soldier Slim? Soldier Boy, sorry. <laughs> Sipping on that Wagyu, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like he would do that stupid <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's if you say so, friend. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about that one. Oh man. Um okay, if we did a sprint, how long would y'all want it to be? We sprint. Just at least one. <laughs> just one. Oh my God. I thought you came. Hold on, hold the on. Sprint was Justin already defense. done. Oh. Justin's defense is trying to get out one. Uh, sprint in. Yeah. One of Why need to be obligatory, girl? Reparations. <laughs> White folks just gonna have to watch us in all earnest today. <laughs> Girl, be yourself. Yeah, I, need a I need a bet refill, and I'm on my desktop also, so I need to go make a beverage. As if you can't leave and come on back to us. <laughs> Bree said she will attend. <laughs> 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 right. stories of Bree. <laughs> one time at band camp. <laughs> um, just I know Bree was like the fuck. <laughs> I guess if you need to sprint, we can sprint for 10 cancer, minutes. I like Bree, are you going to eat something? Yeah, you need That's to eat. That's a great bro. question. Yeah. If we I, sprint, Bree, listen, those who watch mm -hmm. my vlogs about to get a lot of food content. I'm really sorry, but I've been in my eat now. eating bag. Yeah, so you about to vlog making food right now? Every mm -hmm. time I vlogged, and I've been making myself breakfast, lunch, and dinner a lot. Are you, so are just you vlogging been, today? Oh, are you are making you, dinner today? Right now. What are you going to eat? I don't know what I'm gonna Not eat. I got well, I need you to fig figure that out so you can do it well during our short I sprint. Like That's what she did. That's what she did. <laughs> cute little 15. Actually, a cute Kathleen, don't call me out so accurately. <laughs> I love food content because I'm yeah, always I'm chatty Kathy. I'm a Gemini, so I wanted to come in late, just sprinkle after y'all already <laughs> did the damn like these little hoes can wait. <laughs> Paco, I was really to trying leave. to finish my minute, and it took until seven fifteen to finish my two mile. Fifteen point three. Why would you do this, Paco? I love it. So it's great. <laughs> Are we gonna do a cute little fifteen? Is that what we're gonna do? A, a fifteen minute beverage refresher? Right. Who came here to read in this chat? Robin, apparently. I came just to be ready. Okay. <laughs> I have no book in sight. There's no. <laughs> I mean, I, I, no... I, had, I had to be prepared. That's fine. That's fine. I right. guess we can do a Q15. I can make myself a um a grilled tuna melt. There you go. That's food. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, refill. What y'all refilling? I gotta get me a new bar. <laughs> Uh -huh. Zoe Lord said we hit a drink. <laughs> That's why I gotta, I gotta, I gotta top it up. My glass is empty. I thought you were drinking water, hopes, and dreams. No, me, you. Oh, it's because my glass empty. This was a bar. Oh, I feel like we should take a shot just to celebrate this for Jess. Okay. And I am ready. <laughs> Not the <Yeah>. spec. <laughs> no. That's Fedka that's been. <laughs> Has day. it just been on the floor yeah. since last week? Yeah. Look, look at what it's saying. We are the champions. But you didn't even put it back in the freezer? Who cared? Is it okay? <laughs> I mean, it's, I mean, it's just room hot. temperature. You got to drink. You got to take a okay, shot. Okay, I got 1800. I can take that shot. Oh, gosh. My stomach just turned thinking about drinking Svedka. Yes, yeah, is not. Mm -hmm. You guys are so bougie. Ooh, Paco, I got me a strawberries and cream Dr. Pepper today. Ooh, geez, that's so good. Brie had the, 
I, I just vividly remember you putting it down last last, last week. And it's been and there. And then she pulled it right back. It has. It's been there the whole time. I am now full-time stay-at-home dog. <laughs> Please. At least eighteen hundred is better. That Svedka got to go. <laughs> it's got to. Yeah, I need you I to free yourself. A relationship. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah. I don't know where they still Not the backstabbing it. in four K. Is it four K? I don't know. I don't think so. Oh God! Oh God! No! No! <laughs> what was that? Oh. It was like it was showing my screen, but like, no, I don't no, like ma'am, please, screen. please. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean, like. I'm on my desktop, so it's being weird. It's I'm trying to. So we're gonna take a fifteen. Bree's gonna get something. We're all gonna come back with a shot. I don't Not need anything to shot. That's what I'm talking about. Keep it nothing? PG. Hmm. You don't have nothing. Mm -mm. I got an idea for you. I'm gonna text you. Who are oh Lord? Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Ashley, be careful. I know. <laughs> Robin, you're not here to take care of me. This is not letting me share a screen. Why are you being so rude? Windows bastard. Backstabbing in 240. <laughs> <laughs> It is not letting me do that. Anyway, I was going to put it. What time is it? Two, okay, it's about to be 10 after. I'm just going to set a thingy since you want to be ghetto and won't let me show my screen. Windows. So we're just going to be acting up sometimes. All right. Cute little 15 minutes. Be everybody back at. Back shot. What'd you say? I said, everybody come back with your shot. Okay, Robin. Oh, stepdaughter. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Be back. You got 15 minutes. Get your beverages. Come back. Bree, eat food. Okay, now that those bitches are gone. So today, I was just thinking about how work.
Is this ASMR? What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I've been trying to gently welcome people back. They'd be like, you scared me. But then they'd be like, that was creepy. <laughs> I can't win. Anyway, bring your asses back. What's popping? What's going on? Hope you got a drink refill. I did. Hopefully Bree is eating some food. And I have my shot. I, I, know used, right. I used up my um my little infused thingy. Now I got to go get more. Ruh Hello. What was see? That was creepy. See, I can't win. God damn. But How is that Wendy? Spring. <laughs> okay, but then if I go, hey, and it's like, ah, you scared me. <laughs> That's petty. Noise, noise. You just can't, I don't know. There's just something. Because I usually, even if I'm watching the clock, I'm like, okay, sprints are about to be over. You come back. There's just always this like. Surprise, I don't know. I don't know. Brie, did you eat? I did. When did you eat? I forgot I made like this beef stroganoff thing yesterday, so I just ate that. Her. Yay! See, cute little 15 per. Thank you, Elise, for acknowledging that I tried. <laughs> well, how does it feel to be unshackled? Woo! These shackles off my okay. Um, feels wonderful, terrifying, but also great. Is it terrifying because of the financial situation? Yeah. Okay. Not like I don't have you know I have savings and stuff, and obviously a spouse. But I better uh, get to work. I know. I'm yeah. like get a second job. Man, <laughs> reparations coming. <on. laughs> But it feels, because that job really, mm, I think it's one of the worst jobs I've had. And I've had a lot of yeah, jobs. Sucking the life out of it. Truly. Damn. Truly. And nice. look at that. Amazing. Yeah. It was. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You one page. I know that's right. I don't want to know. Look and I, I'm not going to look that. I'm not going to look that up. No, I don't know. Why did you even bring that here? I don't know what that is. Wait, I don't bring what? What was it? You don't need to know. We don't know. We rebuke it. <laughs> we rebuke that. Olivier Awards. It is. And like, I've always worked in customer service. So like I did that before we moved in 2019. Um, then obviously I didn't work overseas, but even just from 2019 to coming back to work in 2022, the, like people always suck, but like, it used to be just some, and now it was like a majority of people. And I know I've heard other people say that like post, you know, first year of COVID and I would love like a, a dissertation or a study into why that is. But like, it was like eight out of 10 people are absolutely insufferable to deal with. I'm like, I just have a job. Like, I'm trying to do it, <laughs> and I'm sorry it sucks, but you don't have to bitch at me. That's true. That's true. It is. Is that by uh, Jesse Q Sutanto? Is that the same? I forgot what the other one was called. But Dial A for Aunties, is that the that one? Wait. What's nasty? A vanilla baby song guy mixed with eight. <laughs> what? What is that? What is it? I don't know what that means. Hi, Ty. Huh? I heard her say, do you like ketchup? Sorry. I was in that fried chicken. <laughs> I was in that fried chicken. Um... I said, is that about my Svetka earlier? Oh, oh. <laughs> I was close. <laughs> I don't know what that was about. Uh, yeah, people have lost it. And I'm like, I had been, and I had so many people who, and not even young people, it was like adults, like 30s, 40s, who could not do things on their own and not like because of mental delay or something. Like, oh, can you talk to my wife? Oh, can you call my mom? No, you're 35 and you own this car. What do you, why would I call your mother? <laughs> oh, it's just like stuff like that. Where I'm like, hey, you all. Oh. 
Oh yeah, so many people would be like, you know, because there's because I had handled a lot of Texas claims. They'd be like, these are labels common in our country, and I'm like, what did I got to do with this claim? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's like, don't be bad. Thank you. Oh, I okay. Let me now. I'm gonna go back up to this. The Zuckerberg thing looked like a vanilla baby song guy mixed with Satan. What? Jack <laughs> Harlow. I don't know what that means. <laughs> that sounds terrifying. I had to slow it down. I was like, vanilla baby song guy. <laughs> In my head, it was one thing. Me, yeah, I didn't. I, didn't. I was like, and then I'll come here, um, vanilla baby. And I was like, Jack Harlow? Oh, I thought they meant like vanilla ice. I'm vanilla baby. I was talking about yeah. Oh, that's I was like vanilla ice mixed with Satan. I'm oh, so no, confused. You that had a girl who's in a chokehold on TikTok for a minute. Yeah, the little the little nerdy white boy with his roots kill. The roots they were losing it. The white boy with the with the one curl and he goes. <laughs> <laughs> He was milking that sound, literally. So many people, can you talk to my wife? Can you talk to my mother? Mm, no, you're 45. Why would I call her? It's her policy. Okay. <laughs> Why don't you have a copy of it? That's no, I'm just so much mess. I cannot. Yes, yeah, so many. Older couples, I would have like, oh, my husband handles everything. But I've had a lot of like men. I'm like, you were the one injured. So I have to talk to you. And they're like, well, no, can you call my wife? No. <laughs> How do you feel? I don't know. <laughs> Ask my wife. <laughs> like, what? The Rubik's Cube guy. Mm. But I think when they said Vanilla Baby song, they meant Jack Harlow. Wait. Mm. Was Jack Harlow the name of that useless character in Iron Flame? <laughs> <laughs> Jack no. Harlow. No. No. Jack Harlow <laughs> Jr.? Oh! <laughs> Because why would you put a junior in there? <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> First of all, I was trying so hard not to bring that up because I know how Robin gets. But I kept Robin literally texted me one morning like, did I make that up? Am I true? No, because I'm like, girl, no. So I requested it from my library to get the ebook so I could highlight Jackson <laughs> Jr. and send it to Robin and be like, no, I really you are did. not crazy. I really gaslit myself into believing you I made did. that up. I was like, I don't think I said that. Anytime I hear Jack Harlow now, that's what I think. I think it's now I think back to Iron Flame. Talk about it. Why would you have a character <laughs> Jack Harlow? And then introduce a character named Jack Barlow Jr. who is not his son and is in fact his brother. And who only shows up in one scene. <sighs> never from Jack Barlow Jr. again. Rebecca. And all the characters are white, so Carl wasn't taken. Carl! That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Bree, did you read, I don't remember, did you read um, Fourth Wing? I read Fourth Wing. Did you read the second one, Iron Flame? Uh -huh. She did. Ash, did Ashley read Fourth Wing? I don't remember. Ashley did, did read yeah. Fourth Wing and she hated it. <laughs> did my girl Ashley go to sleep on her? <laughs> she might be. <laughs> Damn it. My girl said it is oh, not. Wait, hold on. Are we taking the shot or not? Carl oh, Barlow the yeah. Fourth. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> All right. Was Carl taken? Shotty shot. I got a shot. Of what? Lemonade. It made me laugh. What happened to 1800? <laughs> no, okay, she just walked away from me. Huh? Where'd you go? <laughs> I really got to drink that tequila 1800. Just no. One time, one time for the one time. <laughs> one time for one time. Oh my God. That's right, Ty. What you drinking? All right, y'all start. We'll wait for you. No, yeah, no. we can. I can wait. We'll wait. Um, I wanted to ask a question. <clears throat> uh oh, I'm gonna start this shit. No, why would I do that? Um, doesn't I just? I feel like the era of like really good 
hot takes has surpassed us, you know? Cause I feel like anytime someone says a hot take it's very lukewarm Let's see and I'm like, know. that's not hot take. So do you just anyone have any about the book community that they want to share? Hot takes? Publicly, why would you do us like that? I See, mean, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, Brie. Brie, you have a whole three-part series in it, don't you, from the office? It was but great, yes. But that's what the white folks also say. Huh? Right? <laughs> no one knows what hot means. They'll be like, hot take. Ugh, San Jim has is overrated. Boo, we've heard it before. Right. Moving on, moving along. Half a shot here. Okay, All right. I accept it. Half is fine. All right. You already jugged it. No. Oh, I was like, wait a minute. I thought y'all made me do this. Okay, there You're you go. Ready? All right. To Jess. Yes. Woo, fun employment. Woo. Oh, Jesus. Ah! All right. No. Ooh. Yikes. Ashley, you didn't want to be part of that. <sighs> I burned my butt juice. Bree. Bree. <laughs> no more ugly blank face busy covers from traditional public. They have coins. True. When they don't have a face on the cover, it's creepy. Like, I like illustrated covers, but when you just put a blob. I like illustrated covers. I hate when, like, real people open covers, though. Like, I don't want to see your face. Brie. I, I, that's why I had to, I had to, I had to go. I had to free myself. Um, Brie. Brie, answer the question. Whatever. I, I did. Stephen I did. King should go back on the white stuff. <laughs> well, you well, know, you know, I appreciate that. That is, that is a thing that you said. <laughs> Would you tell them that they're wrong? Hey. Some the shift from mass market paperbacks. Wait, you like mass market paperbacks? Seriously, now that was hot. <laughs> that was lukewarm. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I did. Wait, which one? Wait. I was on crack. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was a different way. <laughs> he is old. Like He's been around for a long time. <laughs> True. True. He's like, did I meet my quota? Let me add a few more. I I think I read like one or two Stephen Kings and I just, ah, uh, I'm good. Never a big fan. What is this? Mm -mm. I think I tried to read one of his books and it didn't, it didn't work. I'm really over here trying to think of a hot take. Brie, you got like all of them. You talked about them. But I'm thinking of a new one. I think that's where I'm stuck. I feel like I have some, but I feel like to me, they're not hot takes. Mm, so maybe they would be to me. Just because you don't read something doesn't make you a bitter person. It's the time they're just being... Wait. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> you okay? The words just started. You read it too Yes, then. I was like, okay. Listen, dyslexia, I'm glad you showed you doing it. Because I would have been like, just this because because you don't read. <laughs> <laughs> just because you read something doesn't make you a better person. Because half the time they're just saying it for the crowd. Can you elaborate on that? Please and thank I, you. I think they're saying just because you read something, it don't mean that your shit don't think. Mm. It's going to have to be one of the other ones who be ha ha and kiki and with themselves. Mm. And there are many of those. Okay, I can I can understand that. Oh yes, and so many more romances are coming out in hardcover now. It's like, no, I don't want to pay twenty five dollars for that. 
special edition hardcovers for one series, and that is the only hardcover romance I've had. Yeah, um, put it in a put it in a paperback. Put it in a paperback. Put actually, I want all books come out first in paperback, but oh, <laughs> y'all some haters. Taylor Swift Ghost Rides. It's okay. Anything's possible. I mean, it's not outside the realm of possible. Yeah, I can believe that. I just want to know when I'll when I'll be able to know peace because there is a great overlapping of book community with Swifties, and I just want to be freed. Same. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just like <laughs> interesting. So, like on Twitter, I follow the least amount of book people. My mm -hmm. timeline is just Beyonce and everything else. Mm -hmm. I pulled up Instagram today. Nothing. Everybody's Swift. talking about Taylor Swift. Yep. Yep. I thought I gotta stop. I'm like, skip, just skip, skip. You be my girlfriend. You can bring it, breeze. You can be the <laughs> in the window with the night with the lamp lamp. You can be the cheese. You can be the honey and the beer. You can be the greed. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Bree, are you secretly a Swifty? Stop. <laughs> words. Thank you. No applause necessary. <laughs> <laughs> no, but literally, it's like every other. I'm like, I mean, please. I hate it. I can't. I'm so me. tired of Taylor Swift. Okay, no, but really though, no, I really I would. Ready? Can we? Can we reel it in? No, because here's. Can we pause? Enough, there's enough to read for people to just take a break for two, three years. I think a lot of people should take a break. Because mm. you said I'm a publisher. Was in the drafts. It should have stayed there. It should have. It Hello? Hey, Drafiana. <laughs> I need publishing is a regroup. No name. They need more editors. I'm tired. Oh, I can't stand it. I wish. I wish they would take. Oh, I have one. Um, yeah, I forgot it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm oh, like, please, man. please spare me any. Oh, and I just can't escape it. Even people are like, wait, you too? It's You're so annoying. Deep. Um, I have one. Uh, booktube reset videos, low key slaps. I like, I like resets. I Is love that, resets. You know well, I don't I mean, know if that's a hot take. I just think it's a great. I mean, yeah, they're very popular yeah. right now. You know who the new one I like it so much? Our friend right here. Ray's out here doing the resets. Who's doing the resets? Ray. Other way. Other way. Yes. Other way. <laughs> <laughs> no. Because to me, she's on the other side. <laughs> we do have good resets. Wait, did I figure out what my next reset? Was? What kind of resets do you like, Brie? Different ones? Do you like, like, because I I like it when people be like, look, last week, last month suck. Mm. Over it. Come watch me make my bed, make breakfast, yes. clean my shit. I think my next reset is, oh, I got to clean my closet. I got to switch to, like, I love a cleaning video. We oh, were, um, 50 degree weather to 70 degree weather. So now I got to switch, switch to my spring summer stuff. <laughs> so one of my favorite B rolls to include in my blogs is me unloading the dishwasher. Oh, I do. I love it. I love B roll. <laughs> I love show me, show me, do you doing the dishes? You cooking some food? It's folding also, some clothes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, our ancestors didn't have no dishwasher. So I hey. love show stuff online for show. Uh uh, not the silly clap. <laughs> I'm really doing thinking about Robin because Robin has <laughs> Robin, I, every time I use my dishwasher, I hear Robin in my head like use the dishwasher, break the generational break curse. The curse. Right, yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't wash nothing. Do you hear yes, me? I love that. I will use that dishwasher until Jesus seventh coming. <laughs> and I'm gonna keep using it. Every the Buffy mentions I haven't I'm trying to think of the last time I read a vampire book. I don't do vampires. I don't think I've. There's a lot of performative reading books. Yes. Mm -hmm. Big fan. Okay, what do you mean stop with the fanfics? Like fanfics to track, like publishing fanfics? Hold on now, because fanfic. 
<laughs> I mean, I have never read fanfic in my life, and I'm always so confused when people talk about fanfic because I wouldn't even tell you where I could go to read it. You just Google it, and you're either going to AO3 or fanfiction.net, Wattpad. I read mine on AO3. Yes, she does, and all, and not all, but a lot of her fans like. Not victimize, what is it? Infantilize her almost is like, stop it. You can't talk about her like that. She's yeah. a girl. I'm like, okay. <laughs> girls, girls. Seriously, girls. I need her to take a break. I also I don't want to go no I'm tired of going through her breakups with her. No, no, not Rebecca. Now I knew Rebecca liked uh what's her name? Olivia Rodrigo. What did that man eating the crumble cookie yeah, say? I, I Olivia see. Rodriguez, that Mexican girl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but um <sighs> it's too much. It's too much. Brie. It's not. I made that song the fuck up. I know that that's the, the humming of the song. But I made. I that. mean, you basically got the gist of it. She does. I don't even know what she does. She does. Wait, no, I'll take it You don't read. I'm sorry. Time. I decided to fold my laundry. Okay, wait. My hot take is that if you don't read into somewhat into the backlist of the past 45 years, at least you're not well read. Wait. Have I drank too much? I'm not understanding things today. No, that okay. I think you're saying if you. Don't read something. If you read something, if you don't read something in the last 45 years, you're not well read. Well read. Hmm. Like if you only read stuff from 2015 on. Mm, okay. Hey, Bethany. Hello. With one. I just need, okay, really, I just really need publishing to hire me. Um, because like obviously everything should revolve around my wants and needs, but <laughs> I'm just so tired of the beautiful gowns. Yes, and I'm tired of a of a of a storm and 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 circles and wheaties. Uh, uh, a, uh, huh? A life of honey and crisp. <laughs> a sword of munchies and mix. <laughs> <laughs> The falling of the doom and sunny crispies. The garlic of mash and tato. Like, I'm tired of, of it, Grandpa. I'm tired of it. That's too damn bad. Did you say Lady Swift's Dark Vibes album? I don't know what that means. All I know is something was called a poet. Something. Oh, tortured poet. Oh, tortured. That I've been seeing. And I'm like, spare me. Spare me. <laughs> I'd be rich. I'd be rich. Yes. More poly relationships, please. You gotta get you, you gotta get you a little reset video. They're very popular right now. Ray does them. I know. Uh Olivia Reza Latte does them. A lot of people. Izzy does them. Yep. Monthly resets. I love them. I'm a, I'm a sit sad and be seated every time they come up. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> oh. Facts. Wait, no ebooks should cost more than ten dollars, especially if publishers are gonna continue <laughs> to pay writers and double mint gum. You know what? I it's absurd. I'm really out of pocket, and I'm gonna shut the fuck up. But I agree. No, we can't. Share it with the class because I'm just like, if I buy a physical book, why can't I get like a QR code or something for an ebook or audiobook? At least a, a, a portion off. And why can't I have somebody read to me what the fucking map looks like? Stop telling me the map is in the edit. <laughs> somebody describe what the map looks like. <laughs> I want pig feet, I want hog mug. <laughs> Gotta switch your closet. Yeah, Let me get on a repress, a re not a repress. Um, <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Let me get on the. I was like, I was thinking reset, but reading depressed, and being like, Let me get you on a, a repress. Wow, you a poet. <laughs> <laughs> 
I do, yeah. Hold on, hold on. What was the enemies to lovers? Enemies to lovers is going the way of rom com where people are thinking it means anything. Oh, facts. I, I feel like enemies to lovers is very hard to do. Like it's really it could be like dislike, miscommunication to lovers, lovers, annoyed to lovers. But people be like, oh, they're not enemies. Miscommunication from ten years ago. We're enemies. <laughs> He rolled his eyes at me, and then you find out that he was rolling his eyes at somebody behind her. Exactly. And you're like, I'm saying y'all hated each other for 10 years. Okay. For no reason. For no motherfucking reason. Yep. It's always yes. You know what I hate reading a book, and he's one Bob the Builder motherfucker, and he can't <laughs> express Bob. one emotion. And she's like, but I'm gonna get through the layers. Bitch, this is a trauma response. <laughs> 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 she said, I, you are an onion. I'm going to peel back those layers. We got to stop doing the emotional labor for men. Uh, I love all the conversation online about decentering men. And I'm like, yes. Just lay, while I lay next to one. But I'm like, yeah, I hate men. Woo! I hate men. <laughs> well, I'm married. <laughs> You know, I I married him before I came to that realization. Anniversary, <laughs> you did. You put it online. You were so. Uh -huh. I did. Once I remembered late that I always forget it. Y'all don't celebrate your anniversary. No, we usually forget it. So. <laughs> Both of y'all forgetting, bro. Yeah, I love it. It's usually my phone will because it'll be like memory. From I was like, oh. <laughs> Oh, oh shit, we got married Did on you know? <laughs> <laughs> My bad. No, I do you love you just yell from the other room, hey Bob. That's yeah. <laughs> I do love Bob, but I hate men. <laughs> um, and I tell him this often. I'm like, why are men? Y'all make me sit. And he's like, mm -hmm, I know. Yeah. Glad you understand. He, he knows his place. I hate exactly. Him. I'm gonna take it a step farther, Miss WCO reader. AKA I hate it when Booktube recommends a Booktuber that I already unsubscribed to. Ooh. Stop making this bitch show up. <laughs> I'm kind of like <laughs> Okay, wait. Because I, I, you know, I know you feel the same way about this, but every time I see somebody recommend Arsenic and Adobo for Latinx Heritage Month, I'm like, you didn't read the book. <laughs> One second. <laughs> um. Mm. <sighs> I have seen that way too often. So um, many times. And I always comment it and then they delete the video. And I'm like, but why do people you go that? with what they think a name sounds like? And they're like, oh yeah, that person must be Latinx. I get, I get that Adobo. People don't understand how cultures work sometimes. Fine. <laughs> but it says Tita, not Tia. There's mm -hmm. a difference. I don't care about TikTok book reviews. I don't care what you have thought about the book. Tell me what it is and stop holding the cover. I they piss me off. Yeah, I don't. I don't like that. They're like, oh my god, this obviously this is sprayed edges, but they'll just like, uh, these are some of the greatest books I've ever read in my and then ongoing, ongoing. Show me the goddamn book, bitch. <laughs> That's why I don't do fucking book talks. They piss me off. <sighs> Yeah, they oh. still keep no, it's, it's an uptake and this reading here. Well, oh. you wonder why we all know why it was Kiara Lewis. Uh -huh. All right, what's next? Next, uh, seriously, you know what he said, and Ray. Hey, sunshine. Mm. And hey, I think I have Hallelujah. To, but we know what I'm talking about. I'm sick of it. Fairy, and then it's basically every 75 to 80 percent of the books that are in the fairy loot adult box fall into this category. Another book to which hot take is for bigger creators than myself, just bigger in general. 
just not understanding their responsibility to society and their influence and who the fuck is watching their channel. Like you, you got you can't be picking when and how you want to show up before the nigga. It's okay, Monday. We need to be because your same energy need to be for Black Lives Matter to Indigenous mm-hmm. rights to mm-hmm. free Palestine. Because if you don't understand the interconnection of that, I'm about to kick your ass. Wait, please, please don't hurt your equipment. I don't want you to you hear your laptop. I get, I get so mad when I be like, you were loud. I saw you loud when George Floyd passed. Mm-hmm. It was murdered. I don't even want to say passed, like, you know, but was murdered in them streets. Now Palestine and it's crickets. Now Sudan and it's crickets. If you don't understand how things are connected, then. Bree, why are you asking so much of them? You got to get the fuck from around me. There's a new album out. They're busy. Sorry, I got real <laughs> <laughs> Real upset. Jeez, well. What's Upon Wicked Gods? Do I know that one? Uh, yeah, I don't know what that is. Um, to the Google. <laughs> the titles are just, okay, the there's Google. just, there's so much. The mm. short title, it got to the point. Say that. I have no idea what that is. We know when it's for us. And we Say know that. Mmm. Okay. Publishing gets a hold of like one thing and they're like, let's like the snake or like I feel like thriller covers, they all use like the same font. They're like, let's put it on everything. They just get into like a thing and they're like, let's let's put it on everything. Yeah, that would be nice. A Luda inspired but now see. See, that's like the other day when me and Robin were, there's this book, I can't think of what it is, but every time I see the cover, I think it says, period. <laughs> <laughs> but it does not say that. And I was like, ooh, a hood fantasy. That's what I want. <laughs> and I feel like that's what you can get that a good that is. hood fantasy. I want a hood. Okay, it's this book. It's not a hood fantasy. She made it up. Oh, every okay. time I see it, I see a promise, a period. <laughs> that is not what that says. It's not, but every time I, in my mind, I'm like, what else could it be? Para, paradox, paradox. But yeah, I would love a hood. I would love some, if someone could give authentic, like good recommendations, be so Listen, we that would be incredible. I read a good book that I don't know. I think I think I read it, Murderville. That shit was great. <laughs> a dream of blood, Todd Ash Cash, a jig of pepper. This is what the titles are like. They are, the most people don't have the depth to write a good triangle. love triangle. And the love triangle is literally two people and some motherfucker on the side. <laughs> and they talk to you like twice and you're like, okay. I saw them in the grocery store in aisle six by the eggs and I just fucking, no. I will go meet that person six fucking months from now. Rival. I think more stories would be rivals to lovers would be better descriptions. They're not true enemies. Okay, but are they even rivals? No. Half the time, no. <laughs> it was like half the time it's over miscommunication. Somebody miscommunication just- from 10 years ago. Yep. For Let's do miscommunication to lovers. Or like <laughs> you you had a rest you had a resting bitch face. So I assumed you hate me, hated me. And they're like, I'm no. <laughs> Imagine marketing this book. It's miscommunication of lovers. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what it is. Gonna love it though. Don't fucking love it. Ashley, you sleep. <laughs> she works hard. Okay. Work Maybe. Hard money. I was just thinking that, Brie. Work hard for the money. Mm. Works hard for the money. Mm. 
I hate the trope thing. I'm like, okay, give me like one or two, but I don't need like she'll burn down the world for her. Angry, like all I'm no 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 no. And like, it makes more sense in romance, but I've seen more just genres me. doing it. And you like, know, I hate when they put I hate when they do titles and be like, Jesus meets Jesus. And I'd be like, but they're different. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you know, it might be the same font, but there are differences. Do you hear me? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> what? I need you to come up with another analogy. I wasn't expecting that to be so. so I don't get it. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Brie. Root, you two recommend. I put do not recommend this channel. Um, what I do when they come back, they like, rats, come back. like the rats, they come back. Oof, yikes! I can't stand that. Um, ooh, not a slut for enemies. <laughs> <laughs> I put that as I want to see like <laughs> what? <laughs> what did you read it as? Slut to enemies, and I was like, <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is my time. This is my time. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, because I've been dying to bring it up. I am sick. I am sick of seeing Morgan and her trifling ass baby daddy. I don't give a damn. Like, okay, the latest thing was like apparently he posted revenge porn of her, which is not okay, but. I want people to stop stitching her, stop putting her on my fucking timeline. Wait, who okay. Is Morgan? Morgan is this young girl. She was the first girl to come out and talk about how she got pregnant from some random man from Atlanta, right? Like mm. it ended up being like a trail of like she was like the seventh. Months. Yeah. It's Wait, a lot of them. I didn't know there was recent stuff though. Wait, yeah. did she have the baby? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so and he, he was trifling and left. But then he's come back, and it's like y'all trying to do family vlogger shit or something. Oh, I'm sick. They don't know each other. How no, you, she. No, she, she hated him. But why is he random? Don't random it implies. Well, you know what? Bruce? Didn't she just make up that nickname for him, like to not yeah. say his name? Like she just yeah. made that up, and then other women were like, "Hold oh, up, sorry, I went too deep in it." Yeah. <laughs> but I'm just like. And she's building her whole like platform off of this. Like he left, he came back. He wants to. I'm like, please Wait, leave us alone. Like, they got back together at some point. Yes, he's yeah. been in her house living with her. Yeah. Or, Listen, they they do the same. They always recommend me. He came, but I'm sorry, I'm stuck. I'm sad. Who's I like he came. He came is. I'm always watching and stuff, and I hate her baby dad. And that's, he's so beautiful. Who's he can? Do I know them? You gotta Google it. Is they a light skin? Yeah, and, and the thing is, I, I like he can because she's so funny. Mm -hmm. be like, I just, I'm very conflicted about her. See, I don't like couples content because I either feel like it's either staged or it's toxic. I and um, I don't want it. I hate when they put the babies in there sometimes. Mm -hmm. yeah. I only like Christy and Desmond because I'm convinced that Christy's goal is to give that man a heart attack. I don't know this. Yeah, I agree. They feel real. They feel real. How long have I been married? 12 years and 12 months. Girl. Five years. Girl. Girl. <laughs> it's <That's> five years. <laughs> don't I was like that. Let's don't do Bob like that. It's been five years of marital bliss. <laughs> Wait, remember you didn't like the protein pastry and you were like, you want a snack? I was like, <laughs> <laughs> the doting wife, honey, I got yes. you he, he is so lucky to have me. Hey, let me let me start working on my memoir. He loves Bob <laughs> Payton. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. What, was, what? What? I don't remember. I think this was about um, arsenic and adobo. 
Mm, mm -hmm, people mm -hmm. putting them on the every time yes every time <laughs> i've seen people on tiktok they're like get to the point was it good or not they do all of that i guess on tiktok which i don't I don't get much book talk. Like I rarely will stop for a book talk video, but I have seen people complaining. Like people just talk about too much other shit before they get to like talking about the oh, book. Oh yeah, I do. I do hate the rest. The recipe writers of TikTok, where you just want to jump to the motherfucking recipe. I'm <laughs> they're telling you about their day. And yeah, they be like, it was just a one a beautiful time that I had. With my aunt on the top of Spain, and oh, great. If you don't sit through verse, if you don't sit through it, they won't get enough seconds That's of not my problem. Yeah. You gotta watch at least a minute, and I'm at the bottom going scroll. So you tell me, <laughs> or someone recommends like Listen. five videos, so five books that altered my brain chemistry. I will go so I can see the cover of every book, I and I'm not watching the whole thing. I want to let you oh, know. If I ever send you a TikTok and it starts off right and then it really turns left, I probably didn't watch it. <laughs> I know that. Oh, yeah. That show is still happening. Oh, the reboot, redo of HP on HBO, I think, which I heard about like a year or two ago, but I didn't know it was still happening. There's an HP store movie. They're making a show now on HBO, apparently. Have they not heard about this bitch? Did they don't care. Money, they care? Bree. Oh, yes. The world is too is too driven by greed. It's just upsetting yep. sometimes. More oh. More. oh, I remember this one. I was trying to figure out the mess, what happened with this one on Twitter, and it was too much, and I was like, I'm too lazy to figure it out. I remember what? I've seen somebody talking about that it may be a colonizer romance, but I'm not reading it, so I don't know. I think, I wonder, I feel like a lot of people just are willfully, they just don't care because money. Yeah, they don't care. It's not like you're like, oh my God, I didn't know. It's like, you're chronically online. Like, a lot of people are not. Um... But the people who are like big influencers, you're online. That's how you've grown your platform like this. So you should know. Who would you eat? Yeah, what's that? What's that? <laughs> you got donuts. Donuts? Oh, a pot of donut? Mm, mm. Good. I'm going to leave good. Ashley alone, damn it. She's she getting her rest. Mm. Slight dislike to no, lovers. For real. That's what it is. Slight dislike. What? What I do? What? Oh, oh my god. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you got a book called what? Wait. I would have took it with me too. What did I do? <laughs> Wait, Ray, what did you do? Where? Alicia what happened? Something. Elise said. What I do? I don't know. Man, I yeah. lost it. Where'd it go? I heard what I do, and I was like, "Am I saying that?" Because it sounded like my voice, <laughs> and then I realized it wasn't me. It was not you. It was me. Stop it, Ray. There were reasons. Reasons for what? What are you talking about, Elise's? Sorry, when I be behind in the chat. <laughs> I don't remember what I did. Okay, <laughs> listen. I say a lot of shit. Yes, um, the arrows with all the trope. Kinda, it's so. I kind of like it. I like it. Yeah. <laughs> um, Me too. I love the arrows. But I'm reading every one of them. This is what I wanted to ask, but I didn't want to be so forward. Who are you not trying to watch? I'm not telling y'all that publicly. Uh, I'll, text me. I'll ask you later. <laughs> text me. Text us. Start a group chat. Hey, my friend. No, why isn't there a block button on YouTube? It's no, sickening. No, why wouldn't you let me? Because on TikTok, I block with the quickness. YouTube loud, 
You're yeah. too busy. I don't like how your mouth I'm blocked. Robin will send me two texts. I'm like, sorry, I got that person blocked. I don't remember why. Oh, <laughs> one time I was scrolling through TikTok. I was like in bed, like getting ready to go to sleep. And something with Kiara Lewis came up. It was like a, a, an ad. <sighs> and literally I texted Robin and I was like, why the fuck is this bitch on my time? Oh. <laughs> I had blocked her on TikTok. And then I got on Instagram and two of my like friends who are not online like on not in the book community online sent me her and I was like, do not send me this wretched woman ever again. Blocked her on Instagram. And then somebody sent me her goddamn YouTube. I'm like, if you don't leave me alone, leave oh me. Oh my God. Alone. My love has come back to the chat. Salter. Salter. What do, you, what do you mean that man's customers? Oh, hold on. I'm behind on the ooh. Yeah. yeah. What kind of customer? I'm confused. What's up? See, dang it, I hate being behind. I'm so behind. Ooh. Oh, Risa Tisa can't be topped, honey. Oh, this is <laughs> day before Risa Tisa, yeah. but it, it's not to the level of Risa Tisa. I'm sorry. I got to part seven and I gave up. Oh, I watched, I think I watched 30 something parts and then I, I got a summary from Robin. Y'all know yeah. exactly. We got a summary from Robin. <laughs> <laughs> I got to like 40, like. 49? Wait, Robin, you added it to your story graph, right? I did. I love that people are doing that. Four hours. I, I hate couples content I'm not so lie. much. Add it to your story graph because that's and I love that that is a thing on story graph. Is it really? Yeah. What? Somebody what really. She's actors. She because they've spoken like Daniel Radcliffe and Emma Watson have spoken out of being like in support of trans people, trans women, yeah, and she's like, Bonnie, right? She's and, like, and, 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 I forgot. She said something like. WB made a fucking statement after she did that dumb shit. Like, who? Who's Zaslav? Lord, I don't know. I'm behind. I'm behind. I'm behind. I'm trying to catch up. Catch up. Catch up, Jess. Catch up. Salter, the real one. Where you been at? The, ooh, don't recommend channel. Okay. That I do do the recommend channel, but sometimes it does come up. They still come back. They need to give us a block button. They still come up, man. And I mean, like, there is no reason for it, Elise's. Uh, but one person I blocked a long time ago, I've never seen their stuff. So I just don't get it. They pick and choose what they want to let you. <laughs> <coughs> the summaries. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Random oh. oh. Well, and because of it, Morgan, Morgan lost a sponsorship for something. Really? Oh. Because of Random Man from Atlanta? Mm. Wow. Oh, I got you. Oh, okay. And Bob Iger. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Um, seriously, I sent my friend, I said, if you have not watched my video, watch this video. Don't ever see me that raggedy bitch again. No. Or her snot nose fucking thumbnail. Don't send that shit to me. I need, like, why is she always yelling? And, and snotting and crying. It pisses me off. I'm so sorry. Well, somebody love it. Hey, hey, friend. Friend. White women. Yeah, I guess. I mean, there are people eating it up, so whatever. Because yeah. after that recent somebody thing with the women. you always find your people on the with the award show. show, I guess somebody because I saw it because somebody stitched it. But she was like, Y'all are just mad you don't have the following and the things that oh, I've worked yeah. I've worked my ass off for. Haven't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I told y'all not to bring her up. I did it. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I'm. I ain't never mm -hmm. seen what I did. I definitely what? did. What happened to the back girl? I feel like that. Who oh, Morgan? She's. I'm. I'm tired of seeing her, and I don't even follow that though. You know what? I, you know, I love the expression soft lunch because. <laughs> Who pregnant? What was that? What was that comment? Who's pregnant? By the weed man, Morgan. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> Who's weave? Kiara or Morgan? Morgan got a weave? I can't keep up. Uh, no, Morgan's Mor Mor hair is real. Okay, Kiara's got a bad weave. That all of them are bad. Oh, no soft life. <laughs> Listen, maybe she just don't know. They did. Maybe it's they did. it's bad. It's bad. No, I'm like you can all that money. It's not that bad. Maybe I haven't watched enough of her content. Don't, don't. I should go check it out. 
So I'm not going to disturb Ashley. She's every, on mute. Every, like her comment, her content come along. Her nose do it, Kelly. and she's crying profusely. Because she's yeah. being so performative. Kelly, don't do it. Don't do, don't it. do it. Yes. Yes, she yeah. is. Yes, she is. Don't yes. look. Don't yes. Look the one that made yes. it look fucking national news. Mm -hmm. Literally in a Rolling Stone. It was on ESPN. Embarrassed. CNN. Exactly. Oh, she is resting. Okay. She's so on to something. Exactly. It didn't make sense. Content creators that. always say if we don't like certain content, then we need to search harder to change the algorithm. These platforms for certain creators on it. Yep. Yep. Because some of the things YouTube recommends, I'm like, when have I ever searched or watched anything related to this? No, thank you. <laughs> she's too loud that's why i blocked her way before the hockey thing because she would be so loud go back to venus comic venus. <laughs> it's stiff stiff wear stiff right there it's stiff the edges are rough the glue where is it you know it's not I'm torn. I don't like to publicly take a, a black woman down. But when you know, that, that sometimes wig, you gotta make an exception. When the wig is not Maybelline. Mm -hmm. I just facts. When it's not giving yes. me. Yes, yes, I did. Yes. I did a video about her and her ratchetness. <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, shudder. Exactly. Oh. <laughs> Oh, yeah, he's pissing me off. That's why I've been trying to buy my favorite shows in physical media because even these platforms, these are their own shows, they're taking it off. <gasps> oh, this as I blocked her because I peed and I said, <laughs> <laughs> The bookish diamond, yes, yeah. Yeah. yes, it's unfortunate. It's like because you, uh, it's just ridiculous. And she's like over a million on TikTok, I think. Mm -hmm. And I you're reading saying, Harry people, Potter. People like her. People, there's something she's doing that people is drawn to. It's the dramatic. Well, I think it's the dramatic. So I remember when I first heard a book talker in 2020, and a lot of people were getting popular because they were crying about books. And there was like, and it was a lot of older ones. So people were like getting, the people who were super emotional about books were like blowing up. And that's her thing. She's like everything. If it's a Colleen Hoover, if it's Harry Potter, if it's a little life. She's like, I mean, you see her crying, snot falling down her face. And people for some reason are drawn to that. And I don't, I mean, I, I want to be emotional in a book too, but that just seems perform. I'm like. It's over the top. It's girl, unnecessary. Nobody cares. If I read the book when I was 12 and I was not that emotional. Why are you at your big days? I can't tell like serious. The diamond is silk. <laughs> it's, it's accurate. <laughs> exactly <laughs> this. She does not care about black folks. Yeah. It should be. <laughs> that. Yeah. Also that. Karen mm. in her video, she was like, I am booktube. <laughs> she said she was booktube's yeah. queen. Booktube. Yeah. Booktop. Yeah. yeah. And I said... Yeah, people ain't. Oh, then I almost said Grand Rising, my queen, but I, I mm -hmm. took it back. Yeah, I'm just like, every book is making you feel like that. That's just like every book you read is five star, but like every book is like, oh my god. But you, you, know, by way, you, read, her, but you read her media kit, I would act the fool too, bruh. Yeah, if I read her media kit. I, would yeah. act I was like, this can't be real. That's insane I mean, numbers, but maybe was, it is. If I was a different Brie, I would. I would exactly. Say. Not this Brie. Definitely not this Brie. <laughs> I always want to know what 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 That's period the in the crying. Thing. Do they start before? Do they start the camera before and hope they cry in enough time? No, or you got to be crying before. Oh, I, <laughs> I, I cried, cried, so. cried, and you were like, "This is gold content." Let right. me turn my camera. I don't understand. Right. It's funny because my video that goes up tomorrow is um, books I'll never read. And yeah. one of them is a little life because I was like, "Why were all of y'all crying on the internet?" I don't oh know. my god. I, don't I refuse to read that book. Every person who makes a video is sobbing in it. And I've heard just oh. a lot of people talk about Hanya Yanagahara's like exploitation of queer men, mm -hmm. like the way she writes about them in her stories. I'm like, no. Um, oh. <laughs> this is so particular. It's 
so accurate. A drama llama, please. <laughs> yes. Yes. She oh, did. So she did. Her media kit is basically like, I don't have one because I'm not That's professional right. enough, I guess. But basically saying like your rates. And they were, I can't remember what it was, but I mean, they were kind of crazy for like a 60 yeah. second video. It was like, of course, it was like $50,000. Or like 20 grand or something yeah. like that. Yeah. But still, I was like, what? Like she like, will rave about your book. Her rent's getting paid. Mm -hmm. Her rent's so, getting paid. Meanwhile, the rest of us are going to work, except for Jess. <laughs> and I'm broke. <laughs> but I just, I often wish that I could not have morals or principles or be like be a sellout, but like I can't do it. <laughs> it would just stress me. I'd be so anxious about it. But if I could, I could make some money. That's, you know, you could be a Candace Owens or somebody because those people, they eat it up yeah. when you're like, oh, see this one black person? Not a Candace Owens. But I'm saying she does it for I I don't I mean I don't know if she truly believes what she's saying. She I hate well, her. She so does. Much. She does. Um, she does. But but you see, she's been on her black people tour now that she got fired. Yeah, now that she got fired. Listen, you already told us you ain't had no kitchens in the back. We heard you. <laughs> uh -huh. You and then you think that we don't know that you and Jazz for me <laughs> is twins. <laughs> Twin in them. Go best I'm, friend. Okay. I'm like, what does your husband say to you? Do you let him call you? Yes. Yes. Okay. I don't know if I go that far. She just, because she's married to like some rich white dude, whatever. And you know, props because I did the marrying the white wrong. I didn't marry a rich white and I'm very yeah. upset about it. Um, he did not use his privilege hold on, correctly. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> you Bob like that, all right? We love Bob, but Bob ain't got no money, money. Yes, Jess, it's just side note. When are you gonna let Bob host Prince on the Patreon? Oh, Jess, is oh. Jess, I need you to help me stay moisturized. I don't know how you do it. I really need to be like you when I grow up, because I'm over here looking like I'm uh fucking fifty five by the by the uh, you see wrinkle babes is there? No, don't please wrinkle, let's 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 you're being dramatic. I don't see it actually. I'm no, fifty five by the forehead. No, ma'am. That is another but... perk of being in Jess's Patreon. She sends us weekly reminders to clean our water bottles. <gasps> I'm behind. I filmed one with Bob. Jessica, shh, I'm, oh, sorry. I'm recruiting, okay? <laughs> yes. Weekly continue. reminders to clean our water bottles. It does. Created and get your workout in. Make Love sure it. You're in your body. So Love if it. you haven't joined the Patreon already, come join Owenstown. We're a great community. Uh-huh. We're great. We also have some great sprints. And my girl is unemployed. So unemployed. <laughs> I know some of y'all got two, three dollars. I know you see that little cash contribute thing in that. Uh, Jessica, what are the tiers of Owenstown? Can you, I don't, can you do a little know. <laughs> It's okay. I can look it up. It's fine. Right. I'm in there. I'm in there. Um, better than I can at the moment. No, but really? I just love, I consider skincare to be a hobby because I just love trying things. Um, that is a requirement for all members of Owenstown. You must have a skincare routine. So you at least got to put some sunscreen on. Come on now. That's right. Listen, okay. because of you, I put on sunscreen almost every day. Because of you. <laughs> my, life's pur my life's purpose is complete. But I'll be on there ashy like I ain't got black people watching my channel. <laughs> You're not ashy. ashy. What is this salt stick? So my membership in Owenstown is well, I you changed the tiers, so I don't know if that still applies. But you could be as little as let's see, what's the lowest? I ain't gonna tier? lie. Two dollars a month. Two dollars a month. I ain't gonna lie. I'm the lowest tier. Why? You could be $2. Because I'm to like five other people. 
So it's either one people get a big slice or we slice. <laughs> fair, fair. You hey. could be $2, you could be $5, you could be $10, you could be $15. But if you only got $2 to spare each month, then you can be a part of Owenstown. You can be a part of the Owenstown Council. Not Ray on the marketing team. Wow. Yeah, I did it myself as recruitment chair. So. <laughs> yes. That's the collection plate. <laughs> Not the, not the, not you deleted the crime. Well, I definitely. <laughs> I would never. Away. I would never. Ever. I'm like, maybe you get a little pill. I'm not getting you that. <laughs> oh, okay. I wouldn't do that. Yeah, I'm not getting you that. Yeah, that's I would for ten percent of your. Um... I believe it. After seeing, especially like, what was that dude on Love Is Blind? Do you remember Love him? Is blind? Yeah. <laughs> he put those eye drops in. <laughs> No, free products do not. I don't know how many emails I get from random companies. And I'm like, I remember one, it was like a a removable, it was like a slide on veneer company. And I told them I needed $10,000. <laughs> <laughs> and they were like, oh uh, yeah, we'll get back to you. They never did. But like, I'm, like, I'm, not, no, I'm not doing you this. You could have had those chompers, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> They wanted, and usually most people just say like an integration. So it's just the first part of your video. They wanted an independent video, 10 to 15 minutes. What the fuck am I going to talk about with them things falling out my mouth? Just be like, <laughs> yes. <laughs> nice smile. <one. laughs> I would have like, took it. I would have said, go ahead. <gasps> oh, yeah. They have, they have infiltrated because when you see those videos, I'm like, how do you have 600,000 views on it? Like, oh my God, I read eight no, books this and month. It's, and it's always so, classics. Let me tell you about the industry plants, which is so weird because the industry is books. That's crazy. And <laughs> people who start <laughs> with like, have like five videos and have like 60,000 subscribers. Something ain't going, something ain't right. Where the people like their booktube newbie tag has like 30K views yeah. and they have like two videos. And I'm like, yeah. hmm? what, how? Yeah. Mm -mm. I mean, like, I, I think it's great if you blow up like that, but it's also not something that happens regularly. And I've been seeing it more I frequently. I don't know how yeah. you're getting upwards of thousands and thousands of views upon a booktube newbie tag that you posted <laughs> to read a week ago yeah true but if mm. you have these industry plants and they're hiring let me know <laughs> <laughs> he did not he did not i'm like you were a you were born a white man but why white aren't you tape. wealthier huh god it is. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yeah. Let me do that. Lead to that. Jess, you really need yes. to send, yes. you need to help because uh, we're true, true black women don't gatekeep. Facts. This is true. I can tell you all the things. Oh. Oh. I hate her. <laughs> my mouth. <laughs> 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 we are a long, loving, welcoming. Brie, why would you do Started this? Started the collection plate. That's right. Thank you. I do what I can, man. It's the like I said, here. <laughs> I have had like okay. Uh, Companies that are obviously very much white girl extensions, like I'm like, I have replied like not interested, but and they keep emailing me, like, leave me alone. What am I gonna do? Just clip that on to like? <laughs> can you imagine? Oh, so can you imagine? Clip it in the front, make a little. <laughs> I'm like, you got a bang. Let me just get a bang. <laughs> no, so, <laughs> well, um, so there is, there is so. A company reached out to me for this light thing, and I love to turn it on when I'm watching movies. It's awesome. I use it all the time. I put it in my video because they gave it to me, and I had to put it in my one of my vlogs. And then I sent it to them, and they said, send it to me when it's posted. I said, okay. I send it, and then they sent it. They sent me. They said, well, um, you couldn't really see the light, and it wasn't. you couldn't see it very well. And I'm like, what? 
it's your product that I died in the darkness. <laughs> like if it doesn't work the way you want it to, that's your shit. So then they were like, well, have a nice life. And I said, Ooh. Oh, disrespect. Yeah. That's crazy. Especially for a newbie tag, just in general. Like, I've seen newbie tags get numbers. Yeah. Yeah. They're. Oh, that's- <laughs> it's crazy, but I believe it though. Because some, some, some of the math is not math. There are, there are some people who, like Jess, Robin, and I have talked about this, where you're like, wait a minute, where did you come from? And how do you have such a large following? Because. Usually when you see larger numbers, you see a lot because it'll show you their amount of videos they've posted. And some of these people are brand, they have four videos and they're already at 30K. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, what? Like, you know, I don't know. It's just crazy. What? Thank you. That's right. Pass the collection plate. (laughs) Become a member of Owens Town. Um, You are required to change your last name to Owens. But it's okay. It's fine. <laughs> you know, you know. And then, um, we're going to on Friday. Got the bloodletting. Bloodletting on Friday. We call ourselves the Red Sprayer. <laughs> no. Um, no. We must all hail Nigel. Now that is a requirement. This is Frenchie. And, and his all hail Nigel. And that funky side eye. <laughs> he, he goes side eye the fuck out of you. He is, and and I read this study that says pets get the personality of their owners. So. They do. They do. And so just be side eyeing the fuck out of us too. Apparently. Well, <laughs> that's my son. Um. Um. Me and Rob were talking about this earlier because I don't know if y'all have seen the trend on social media of veneer texts. It is a plague. Mm-hmm. And it is people getting like these like one day certifications. They're not real to be a veneer tech. And they're doing veneer. They're just like veneers by Vanessa. And just that's so how, bad. Look, that's when, I look, when I saw people teeth get drilled down as if they ready to bite into the nearest neck. <laughs> I said, no I am. <laughs> so, I'm like, I would only do that if that was absolutely necessary. Like, I'm trying to keep these Oh chumpers. my God, I love that. And some of them is given like, and I love it. Get off the internet. What are they giving? <laughs> they give him and I'm like get on the internet and show these people that what you look like ain't always what it is I know I have been watching I love it. Ones. Oh, oh God, thank you it's, I mean so, I, sign me up <laughs> I'm trying to be a play I really feel like if your channel blows up it's. I just feel like that to be nerve wracking yeah the i don't know um i know the big ones like the, the ones i'm seeing like the crazy views like i'm seeing 500 hundred thousand, whatever a lot of those they were like lifestyle and they decided to start reading which is great but then they become like these dominant creators in the booktube space when that's like not primarily their thing and they're mainly not all of them but they're like Reading Sarah J. Mass. We're like, oh my yeah, god, like, reading you know, something else. I don't I'm know. reading Pride and Prejudice. That bitch died a long time. She must. I'm fucking. Yes. Listen, yes, we must all meet at the Nigel. At the Nigel. It is necessary. There is a Nigel yes. in Owens Town Square. Yeah. <laughs> it's, no, but there's like no. braces by Bria, veneers <laughs> by Vanessa. I about this because we were talking about it earlier. And I was like, I don't know what's worse, the veneers or the braces. And you said veneers are definitely the worst. But I'm starting to think about, about braces and how they can change your whole jaw alignment. Like, Yeah. But I want braces. I think it depends on because some a lot of these veneer techs are just putting 
caps like they're or they're just putting like a they're not filing their teeth yeah down. they're not filing their they're teeth. just putting them like over their teeth and they are just putting chiclets in their mouth so maybe the braces are worse because i mean if you rearrange my jaw now we have a problem like are you tightening them uh, yeah uh, in your sorry. garage like i'm just sitting here and you're just i don't even know what you use to tighten Braces, but I'm like, <laughs> I just remember when I first started sending you the braces once, and it used to be people with like flat and all kinds of thing in their teeth. Ew. Ew. Nasty work. I'm like, this person <laughs> says that they do tattoos, nails, and braces. Yes. Something is wrong. Listen, they said they gonna get their money. <laughs> they are. <laughs> dollar dollar bill, your cash rule. <laughs> Literally. Interesting. Yeah, the algorithm is weird. Yeah. Yes. Uh, no, and then some people are like, oh, they're trying to gatekeep and saying you have to get to go to dental school because it's you're supposed to go to dental you're school. Supposed to go to dental. <laughs> but they're like, I got my, my veneer tech certification. That dude I sent you today. <laughs> I'm like, please. I mean, I know that was printed. I know that was made on Canva. Black don't lie to me. Braces? I don't want the black market braces. They're like, oh, a one stop shop. <laughs> <laughs> I would think that, honestly. <laughs> no, but think about it. Think about you're getting your veneers done. You might as well get your eyelashes done because you're gonna be laying down anyway. Hello. <laughs> no. no, Beth. I mean braces. I mean, I had braces a long time ago, and I knew they're expensive. But I just and some people are getting what do they call them? Fashion, fashion braces. I might get Invisalign, but what you mean? Uh, fashion bracelets? Because you know, you remember like when you were in high school and kind of everybody had braces. It was and, cool you know, to have colors. Like, cool, and like you would go change your colors out so people can go get fashion bracelets. So they just get them put on and they don't necessarily need them. See, but they do tighten them because you can't just have like loose wire in your mouth. So then it starts to shift your mouth. It's... It's a given stupidity. Yes. Yes. And they're just going to a... Mm. Mm -hmm. it's bad good. as the veneers are i'm like how are you chewing any how are you biting anything i don't think they can that's why i'm afraid i'm not really afraid but you know certain things leave your hair your teeth your skin when you get older and I'm just not ready for when I bite in the chicken bone and the chicken bone. Come, come, I look back at it and they got my molars just hanging. <laughs> if I like look back at it, I put a fat medic on a fat. I <laughs> believe this. Yeah. That's yeah. bother me. It's crazy. I'm like, this isn't like something small. <clears throat> Med dental, like your teeth, once you're an adult, they don't grow back. Like this is all you got. <laughs> It's really? it's bad. Yeah, I'm never getting braces again. I my wisdom teeth came in and like so my gap came back a little bit and the bottom got a little crooked and I was like, oh let me just go see how much a visaline will be is it can't be that much. Yeah. It was gonna be like six months, maybe six to eight months, and they wanted eight grand. That dollars. And I said, I guess these are my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm sticking with them. <laughs> yeah, th listen, the price have really stopped me from Invisalign because I said I'm gonna just be out here cricket then because it's I crazy. No, ma'am. You need to go to like a specialist, even like not even just a dentist for good veneers. And people are going to Mike to get a random Mike the insurance guy. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I can fix your car. I can sell you insurance. I can put in veneers. <laughs> and this line is stupid expensive. I'm like, that's not even for, because it was like six to eight thousand dollars. I think I forgot how much was the deposit. Getting a permanent uh, retainer was like four, just four hundred dollars. It was crazy. I don't know how. 
I would have been more amenable to to 2000, but maybe the orthodontist I went to. I don't think so. I know that a uh, Smile Direct Club. Yeah. That went out of business. That like one you could order online. Oh wow, that was already sketchy. Yeah, at least two grand up, two grand for a year. I might have to. That's not bad. That's not bad. They quoted me a lot. Night guard, girl, guard your own mouth. (laughs) (laughs) I just know that if I had done Invisalign, I would somehow end up throwing away one of the things. When I like took it off to eat or something, knowing my luck. Oh, this bra is cutting. Oh no, free yourself. Mm. <laughs> Joey G <laughs> from the neighborhood. Come on over. I make you a plate and I fix your teeth. Yeah. I was like, I've never wanted to be an adult with metal braces, so I'm just gonna have to stick with these teeth. Yeah, I feel like every time I went to the dentist, I got asked if they wanted to if I wanted to close like the little gap between my two front teeth, and I was just like, no, I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. yeah. So I'm okay. Call, then call me Gabriana. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the gap isn't that big, so I'm like, it's fine. But everyone kept bringing it up, and I'm like, well, should I close it? People be bringing shit up, and I'll be like, but you've been balding and been holding on to your side. <laughs> About seven motherfucking years. Did I tell you anything when you decided to park the Red Sea? No. So don't come on and tell me shit about my goddamn thing. <laughs> I had a bigger gap. Both my parents have a gap. And now it's kind of small. But I'm like, oh, well. Like, my gap is not that big. So I'm just my like, whatever. Never. But, like, I never wanted to close it. Like, even when I was younger, I would always oh my get God. out of braces. And I'm like, no. Stop it, Kelly. That's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> I was really self-conscious about my smile when I was younger. So I always smiled with my mouth closed. I'd be like, hmm. <laughs> And then after braces, I was like, oh, my teeth are perfect. And then my wisdom teeth fucked it up. But, I mean, I don't hate my teeth now. I just, everything. they need a little whitening. <laughs> That's, I want. Has anybody tried? Uh, are Crest white strips worth it? Because I've been thinking about it. They this are. Is, if you are, which you probably would be, like really diligent in using. Oh them. yeah, I, I definitely would be. No, I just, just recently really started hard. using them. All right, maybe I'll, I'm gonna do that. Yes, what happened key? to your screen? Oh, I have a webcam plugged in, and like I keep swinging my foot, and it like hits the cord, and it makes me, it gets mad at me, I guess. My webcam stopped working and then it became above me. Mm. <clears throat> exactly. Yeah, people love listen in New Orleans, you got a gap, you that mug. It means like uh, it means that you know good. <laughs> well, let me put out <laughs> good. You know, I <laughs> <link> is good. <laughs> You got that fire brown. <laughs> Ray, do you have sensitive teeth? I've done I've started this week. Um, but yeah. let me tell you what, the 30 minutes I have to leave those strips on is the longest 30 minutes of my life. I'm just like Does it like feel weird in your mouth? Kind of. Yeah. Because it kind of like it's I don't like, know, my uh, mouth starts to feel like, like I'm it's generating like, more sal- saliva. Yeah. And then you're like it's weird. What but... did you say? It's like scotch tape on your teeth. Oh, it feels like scotch tape on your teeth. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. Yes, that's the salad. I just like I got so much <laughs> in my mouth. But yeah, that's was like okay. I'm mean, looking a little yellow. That, that, yeah, I don't I don't know. I feel like my teeth could be whiter. So I mean, granted, I do drink a lot of coffee. So yeah, I do it at night. Before oh, you sound stupid. Okay. Yeah, I don't talk. I'm like, <laughs> I mean, only people I talk to is y'all. So <laughs> yeah, I feel like I when we were we were growing up, it was more like to fix your teeth. But I feel like it's different teeth and not. I feel like with the rise of veneers, especially with famous people, people have realized the beauty of everyone's teeth not looking the same. And so it's definitely like more accepted because it's just like veneers are so bo- everyone your teeth are just like. But I feel like veneer one wrong move and you gonna be the wrong move. 
one wrong crunch. Yes. That's it. That's it. That's all. And then you're going to be out here looking like Freddie versus Jason. <laughs> <laughs> situation some of them like if you i guess make them but when they're like bright white and all the same size I, they look as terrible yeah they be yeah but some people think that's what they want well mm -hmm. okay what i just because like jess i feel like you have said that you have a thing about teeth like when it comes to like men, oh, right? Mm -hmm. right? So like I mm -hmm. like if I see a man with a really nice smile, I'm like, oh, that mm -hmm. man's very attractive. Yeah, I mean, I the like only the man's teeth that look past are Tom Hardy's. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true. Cause I love Tom Hardy. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna lie. Sometimes I've seen some pretty teeth on some men, and I've thought. What that mouth do? I, I can't be the only one. I can be bosses. I know. No, yeah. Well, I mean, when I was dating, I was like, let me see. I gotta see. You're. I was very judgmental about teeth and like hands and nails. Um, and so yeah, I'm. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> that came into consideration. But Tom Hardy is an exception. Oh, I did give a notice, and then I shortened it. <laughs> she did. <laughs> I was like, here's my month notice. And then they wanted to play games. So I said, just kidding. Next week will be my last. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Bitches. Um, yeah. And I've noticed this conversation with this and just like filler and stuff come up with like period pieces. Cause like, don't be in a period piece. <laughs> Goddamn veneers and she and like lip filler. It's <sighs> it's a plague on society currently. I feel like lip fillers do look good on some people. I feel like very few. Now, it's different. Yes. <laughs> Turn the veneer lights down. Look, yeah. It's different when your lips look like you got two thumbs. <laughs> if that's not naturally you, babes, don't go and add the two thumbs. Don't go and add it, babes. But if you want to get a little... Because you might got uh, the thin lip disease out there, and you're looking like a noodle. Just one shot. <laughs> Very few people can pull off lip filler. Yeah, it yeah. always ends up looking it looks unnatural. Yeah, I've yeah. Seen people where it's done nice. Yes, this because it's like. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I read that if your nails is dirty you ain't got no job <laughs> no I okay I, I have a joke but I'll tell you guys after because it may be inappropriate no, go ahead go ahead say it Brie say it Brie oh no, it's not good it don't matter. This listen, I, we already predicted that it's going to get private. At some point, so go ahead. Listen, as they say in Ukrainian, "Yane mozhu." I can't <laughs> throwing the language at us. Right, my, yeah. my fellow white women, I beseech you. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's say, it, Bri. Yeah. Just say it. Just say it, Bree. <sighs> All right. I just usually want to, you the one that be misbehaving in the lives, bro. I can't because I just realized that it can be, it can, it can mean that I'm joking about people who are houseless, and that's not. It was something that it reminded me of some of a joke someone said to me, and I was like, I don't like it. Okay. All right, we won't pressure you. <laughs> Text me. <laughs> what time? Oh, it's funny. I felt it felt later. I uh, listen. It felt later. How do you feel about quitting this funky ass job? Can we say that publicly? Let's talk about that. How do I feel? I feel over the moon. It was the worst. I hated it. <laughs> it was I hated waking up every day because I had to work at that job. <laughs> Literally. Um. Yeah, it's just uh, 
I've worked in customer service, unfortunately, for the majority of my life. And I've worked in insurance since 2016. Uh, and they just all have the same problem. They don't have enough staffing. So you always have way too much work for the amount of hours. The difference with this job versus my other two was I was hourly in the other two. So like, I didn't have to work overtime, but I could. And I was getting paid for it. This job could not be done in 40 hours. And you were we were salary. And so there were a lot of people who would work over. There were people on my team who would come in on their day off or like log in on their day off. I was not doing that. And they're like, well, so give me peace of mind to keep up. I'm like, well, I'm not fucking doing that because my job is 40 hours or paying me for. I should be able to do it in that 40 hours. And you yeah. couldn't. Um, and so they're always like, we don't have enough staff. And it's like, why do, why do you think that is? Like claims is just a high turnover because it's shitty. There's all these metrics. They're always micromanaging everything you fucking do. Being on the phone. And it was just like, no matter what I did, it was never enough unless I was willing to work longer and I was not <laughs> so I, I just didn't like the spinning the wheel to decide who works on a fucking Saturday <laughs> like what do you mean I'm like it won't be me Joseph uh, the older I get like my last job that y'all know I hate it oh I God. that job is the reason why I cannot do not a thing above what you said my job description was. Not a thing more. I'm not doing, I don't care if I gotta be the the one who, I'm not doing shit. Because if it cannot get done within the parameters that you set, mm -hmm. that's it. Yeah. Oh, well, I'm like, they're like, well, sometimes you just gotta work later. No, nope. maybe you do. You're not paying me to do that. So I will not be. See, I'm like 4.30. I'm done. <laughs> and so, and then they already saw like our general, and it's very like, I don't know if other industries are like this, but insurance, they're very much like show all of your stats, like how you're doing to everybody. So they're always posted. So like your entire team sees it. And then they were having this thing where, Instead of you having a one-on-one -on -one, like performance review with your supervisor, it was the like entire team watching everyone do their performance review with the supervisor and, and his supervisor. And they already saw trending like all state. Whoops, I didn't mean to see the company, insurance company wide. No, that it's fine. Um, insurance company wide that people weren't meeting these numbers that they wanted them to meet. And then they increase them. They're like, okay, well, you're not meeting this amount of number of answering phone calls. We're going to increase it. And they were added, like, added more metrics. And I'm like, we're already not making these. And they're like, more. And they're like, more claims. More, more, more. So I was just like, fuck this. <laughs> I can't do it anymore. Hello. Bye. Gotta that's, go. And that's why Nationwide should be on your side. There, <laughs> <laughs> you got you must. Truly a wheel. I was in auto insurance. I had to deal with customers. I did bodily injury for the most of it. Also, your picture is giving face. So, people like, oh my god, oh, I had to go to the emergency room. And I'm like, mm -hmm. okay, but. Yeah, they would like they had they would download teams on their phone. No, yeah. <laughs> they'd be like on PTO checking in. Absolutely not. Absolutely. <laughs> I'm not gonna no, lie, I do no. have teams on my phone, but that's because sometimes I'd be taking a long time in the bathroom and I'd be <laughs> one minute to know that I'm here at 9 a.m., even though I'm on the toilet. <laughs> I, have, I have teams on my phone so like i'll look at those because we have like a building wide group chat but i recently turned my outlook notifications off mm -hmm. best decision i've ever made oh you know, nice I'm out of the office babe i'll i'll catch you on tuesday Bree, this is crazy one of my old managers what excuse me he was going to a funeral and he logged on and was like i was like why are you working oh i just need to go to the funeral like Mm, mm, mm. Damn. Yep. I don't give a fuck about that person who died. I care about this job. Mm -mm. One, one hour. 
Wait, hold up. You're so fast. Why oh, sorry. Do Where do you want me to go? This <laughs> one? That's <laughs> damn. <laughs> At first, I let it slide for the first hour. <laughs> I had to bring this shit back up. Then One I, hour. I had to advocate for me. <laughs> I'm proud of you. <laughs> One hour of overtime. That's crazy. Excuse me? Mm. No. That's crazy. And so many people I work with are like, these are people on my team. They're like, it's so hard since I work from home to like log off. What is yeah, easier okay. for me? I'm like, my, I know my bed is right there. <laughs> Please. Okay. And the only the only time I work past my time, if let's say the day before, I had six hours of nothing, and I'll like I'll be like, all right, I'm Sally, I can flex a little bit here. Mm -hmm. but if I ain't got no room to flex, baby, I'm exactly I'm, I'm gonna be sit sat at seated at four thirty one watching Charm. That hello, yes. What do they count on your clicks for? When I first started and like I didn't have as much volume and I got a mouse jiggler that thing was amazing it just kept me looking green and <laughs> yeah and they were like when I worked I worked at State Farm a while ago and that was call center so like just whatever was coming in <laughs> but this job we owned the claims but then we also had to take calls all the time so it was like they were like you need to focus on this and focus on this but also be available I'm like I don't think you know the definition of focus because I cannot focus on all of these things and be taking all of these incoming calls and go to these three hour meetings and like. I do that too, Jaleesa. Oh I found that out via TikTok. I put myself in meetings all the time. Oh yeah, I block, oh, here. Off. I block off time. Like I'm not yeah. taking any meetings at 8 a.m. I'm not taking anything at 9 a.m. I'm not taking anything at 4 p.m. And don't try to schedule a meeting on a Friday afternoon. Disrespectful. Listen, I'm not taking nothing before 9. Facts. And really after 1, you done piss me off. <laughs> but I'm a therapist, so I and I stay later because I start later. So I That's use fair. No, I use but like I had, I had a big event last Saturday. And so like... I'm very big on boundaries. Like if it, if it's after five o'clock, don't talk to me about nothing work related. Don't do Amen. it. Don't text me before 8 30 a.m. Just don't text me after 10 p.m. <laughs> <laughs> like that. <laughs> but like no. at 10 o'clock, I'd be in a bed. I'm reading something Just on my Kindle and I'm trying to post leave me alone. Don't text <laughs> me. You got something important to say to me. But also, like my bot, like mind you, my supervisor, she will like talk to people about how I set like really hard boundaries with her from the beginning. And I'm like, yeah, don't do it. Cause like, if you ask me something work related after five o'clock and it's not an emergency, I don't care. I'm gonna respond to you tomorrow morning at eight 30 when my work day starts. My thing is this, have I ever texted you after 10? Well, Brie, I have you silenced because you're in a different time zone. And I know that you're a night owl. <laughs> <laughs> Brie, I am shooketh at this. Try I feel so hurt, but also respect. Why are you hurt? Why are you? I'm, I'm, <laughs> wait, why are you hurt? I, 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 feel good. I, I have my D and D on. No, no, no. That all is day. not. That's not a bad thing. I'm just saying. I know that we're in different time zones, and I know you'd be up late. So that way, with you being silenced, I won't cuss you out because that's typically what happens if somebody texts me after. <laughs> Because I will text somebody after this. Exactly. And no, see, here's the thing. And Jess doesn't like this. I'm not going to put my phone on Do Not Disturb. I just expect you to respect the boundaries. <laughs> Sometimes that's what I remember to respond. <laughs> I am stuck see, on this because so I, the mouse mover, life changing. Well, and on. their tracking clicks is cool. Oh Wait, my God. Hold on. What is a mouse mover? So it's literally just, I have one over here, like just but it's a, a little thing. So it, um, you put your mouse on it and it like slowly moves their mouse around your screen while you're not there so that it keeps your computer from going like to sleep or to keep you green. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Y'all jobs be tracking you like that? That's well, I didn't, I didn't get tracked by clicks. I just kept my thing green, but that is crazy. That's why, here's the thing. So I recently decided to start acting my wage because 
There is no going above and beyond. There is no doing mm -hmm. extra. There is no other duties as a sign. I'm going to do what you pay me for, and that's it. Hello. Y'all don't want to pay me more when I'm doing director level work and you're only paying me as an assistant director and won't even bump me up to associate director. Um, you're gonna get yeah. My, my thing is this. I, I'm in a new job <coughs> where they'll say, here is a link. You haven't been compliant this week. I'll go in there. It shows every clinician who don't have their paperwork at zero. Mm. And then they'll be like, we did an audit of your cases. They do an audit of my cases every week. And if I don't meet the amount of people to see, they add new people. So I'm constantly swamped. I'm constantly overwhelmed. Nigel. And I'm like, what the hell is that? A dog? No, I'm just kidding. But yeah. <laughs> um, for any potential new members of Owenstown, all hail Nigel. Here you go. Why do you don't. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Nigel. <laughs> Be on you. This is the Nigel. And. Um, Nigel, I want to be on your lap, Jess. I, Nigel does not like to be on camera. He will side eye the fuck out of you. And he side eye it now. <laughs> you gotta accept it. That's what he does. That is his role. But here's the thing. He was behind me whining. He got off his bed. And so I'm like, what do you want me to do? I was like, pick him up. Then he acts like this. <laughs> he was like, I wanted attention from my mother, not the whole community. the <laughs> side <laughs> He he's it. like, all right, I'm over it. Yeah, he's he's done now. He said, F this. I don't want to be here. <sighs> well, I'm, expecting, I'm expecting Jess to uh, have new Patreon members in the morning. I expect. Um, Acting my way. I need y'all to get on it. Remember, the lowest tier is only $2. So, did you have a lot of compliance testing? Uh, not testing, no. No, I feel like there was always something to a new training or something we had to do. And always some new compliance project, they like to call it. Exactly. My old job, I remember my manager being like, because when I worked for State Farm, you had to like, if you were not on, so your schedule is like planned. So it's say if you were supposed to be taking calls, if this is your break. So if you had to do, like you had to go to the bathroom, it would be like unplanned. And she's like, you have a lot of unplanned. I'm like, yeah, I got to pee. I got to the bathroom. <laughs> what do you want me to do about it? Like, I'm not going to apologize. I have a small bladder and I drink a 64 ounce water bottle every day. Yes. Okay. They're crazy. I'm like, I'm not going to be dehydrated for you, nor he he does not. <laughs> he said, worship me from a distance. <laughs> Don't look directly at me as you bow. Don't look me in the eye. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, don't do no. stuff towards the end. I'm, it's a wrap. I will pick this up tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the thing. So my boss knows that I don't like her boss. So every time her boss requests something, I'd be like, I'm not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the these um these corporations, they get on my nerves. I'm sick of it. All the shit I see on social media. I'm like, it's stupid. Just how do we it it's just ridiculous? Like, we're not in emergency medicine, okay? Like I get an in, a, like insurance that. claim is pressing, but we're we're not doctors, it's okay? Not this is not like the ER. <laughs> like I see people on TikTok being like, "I work in marketing. This is not an emergency." Truly, I asked my supervisor to fire me, and she was like, "Oh, should I put you on a pip?" And I was like, "Yeah." And she was like, "For what? What am I supposed to tell people that you're not doing your job? Nobody's gonna believe that." And I was like, "I can stop doing my job. <laughs> Let me help you make it believable. I can make that happen." I <laughs> saw that. I was like, "If y'all don't get out my face, I'm sick." So what? But what? Uh, so what's the point then? They want people who aren't looking. Apparently, I don't know. Nah, I'm looking. I'm trying to get the fuck out of higher education. Okay. <sighs> this part. They're like, well, 
the ideal person can do all of these things in a certain amount of time. It's like, well, if you're not clicking or typing, you're not working. Damn. Really? That's crazy. So they say you better get this carpal tunnel. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> is everything as well. Yeah. Well, it's not great. Depending on what you are you is it a customer service based role? Because there's other ones that aren't as bad. I want to be a housewife. Well, yes. Yeah. Um Here's the thing. I want to, I don't care about the, I want to work in a job that doesn't take a lot of brain power where I can just go beep, bop, beep, bop. I'm typing something. I can listen to like an audiobook or a podcast. I leave it there. I just clock out and be done for the day. I don't know what that is. Just like a basic like, data entry kind of thing. Yeah. I was about that, Jess. I was like, like data entry jobs because I was like, I want something where I don't have to interact with other humans. Yes. Like I just might have to reply to an email here or there. I don't want to talk directly to people. I don't need to like interact with the team. I just want to. There you know, cloud engineering is coming up. I'm it's not. That like, sounds too smart for me. I didn't, I didn't <laughs> go to school for engineering. I went to school for business administration and then higher yeah. education leadership. I have certifications in DEI leadership, human resources, and project management. I am, I don't have no engineering brain. I'm trying to get well, low you brain. You told me the way you just did. You shot on me. You shot on me. I did not. Yeah. Moving, moving. Free, you have five, you have 18 degrees past the shatness that's just oozing from my face. If you grew, you, <laughs> you, you are the most educated person on this junior. Not You're an analyst, you 87 too degrees. the 87. See, that's why I'm telling people. that's why I'll tell people. Because and and people. ain't you going back for another one? Yes. See, this is we were we were all meant to frolic. I, that's what I want to do. I know realistically I can't do I that. Just, I, I'm not asking for much, right? Like I'm not a high maintenance person or whatever. I just I just want somebody else to pay my bills so I can read all day. Mm -hmm. Ooh, you finance man. this 30 hours. I don't want 40. I oh, don't talk to customers. Four day work just like man. Yeah, one of my jobs is a four day work week, and I love it. I need that. Yeah, a little Monday. <laughs> Paco, <laughs> tennis lessons at the club. Yes, I just, I don't want, I don't want to have to think. I just want to be like, here's this, what we need you to type. Okay. I need some old <laughs> white couple to say, you know what? I haven't done my reparations. I want yes. to sponsor this young, beautiful. Yes. Yeah. And go ahead and pay for my life. Yes. I'm always like, where's the white guilt with money? Come yes. on. Yes. <laughs> Come on. Truly. Yeah. Cause Truly. like I used to care about like, oh, I need to get something in my my industry or something. I no longer care about the title level field of the job. I just want it to be low energy. <laughs> Beep boop pop boop pop. And then go by my day. <laughs> No, <laughs> that is not bad. But finance, no, nobody wants me working in finance. Yes, <laughs> I'm trying to be yes. a I don't gotta cook or clean. Do not go into claims. Claims is absolute hell. Mm, that's Nigel. He loves to be an iguana. <laughs> yeah, being in a trans, the way they we go from school and being out for the summer and then adult life is not like that is cruel. It's wild. It is crazy. I no, but those kids uh -huh. don't let you do no work. They always in your office. <laughs> Yo, Bree, I literally work in a student center for college students, and the amount of times that my days interrupted just because some student wanted to give me an update on their friend drama or tell me some dumb shit that don't matter. Ever get your work done, bruh. Come and, then, and then you close the door and they start knocking. They start complaining. She, uh, I have a whiteboard that says like in a meeting, remote until this day or whatever. But then I'll come back and I have like my schedule, my in-office days on my student schedule, my student worker schedule. But they'll be like, Ray, you weren't here. And I'd be like, yeah, but you knew that. And they were like, well, I wanted you to be here because I was here. That's not my job. Oh. 
This is clinginess, man. Very. It's clinginess. <sighs> Both of these mugs done fell asleep on us. <laughs> I'm awake. She's after, awake, just you know. After that cat nap you took, like you gonna act like we ain't see it. <laughs> I've been awake the whole time. Oh, look at her down there, so comfortable. I bet she's sleeping good. I hope so. She deserve it. She does. Mm -hmm. She do. Nice. I've been trying to do that all day. Um, Bree, you want to plug your podcast appearance? What podcast? The one you sent us this morning. What do you mean? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was on Horror Ho Support Group as we talked about horror movies and horror books that are coming out this year that we're excited about. So go, go out there and check out Horror Ho <laughs> Support Group. <laughs> Oh, H-E-A-U-X. Horror Ho. Horror Ho Support Group. Horror Ho Support Group. It was I a good listen. The link, but it won't copy. So mm -hmm. Yeah, it was a good listen, though. I listened to it this morning. Oh, you did? I did. Cool. I think cool. y'all was going to listen. I listened when I was walking the dog, and then I came in. I didn't want to get out of bed, so I was like, might as well listen to this podcast episode. Damn. That's how you feel. Thunder thing. Hold on. Bree, Bree, since you're doing your aggressive typing, uh, when are you going to listen to me on uh, Bingo Board? When I'm what? Release the Patreon Bingo Board. Girl, I don't even know what it's going to look like. Well, for I what? give you enough topics. I know, but I just... Because the, the, the loud typing, I get it every time. Listen, I just don't get it. I was like, no one's going to come at me typing today. And that was a lie. No, nah, I, I, I hear it every time. And I'm like, you know. This clicking is unreal. This clicking is next level. <laughs> <laughs> this clicking is so loud. Yes, I need white guilt with money. Facts. This is all I want. Mm. Jess's, Jess's goal is to, you know, we all buy a plot of land together. And that's what I keep talking about. A commune of friends. Build our but that's community. what we need. And we make Owens Town a reality and not yes. just a virtual. Because reality. this government, this is the only way we're going to survive with this raggedy government. We're going to have to pool our resources. We <laughs> have to pool them. We need people who can garden and sew and build and all the different, everyone's different skills. We got therapists. Mm -hmm. We got enough people. Mm hmm. All the trait, all the different. I believe Robin is head of the welcome committee. I'm obviously the recruitment chair. Yes. Um, yes. We hail the Nigel, and um, you know we have Jess, our first lady, and Bob, our first husband. <laughs> <laughs> it's great, husband. Yes. yes. Here's the thing. Exactly. I don't want. I used to be like, oh, I want to make all this money. I don't. I don't. Okay. Here's the thing. I just need me a little something. <laughs> And like so, my job. We we didn't get merit this year, but also like rent keeps going up. But my job doesn't do anything for like cost of living increases. So like inflation is happening, but my paycheck is staying the same. And it just mm. don't to me. That's how Which I is crazy. Think. Everything can inflate. The cost of everything can inflate, but our labor. That part. Well, somebody thighs get smaller and they ass get fatter, and I don't be understanding how it happens. And but so you just gotta breathe. <laughs> <Free. laughs> come on, man. Some BBLs ain't matching. It's giving chicken legs. The I feel like what most BBLs don't match. What's that sound on TikTok? These BBLs killing y'all. <laughs> because your thighs don't match. <laughs> Some thighs be matching, like, some, some, but a lot of them, I like those be so good, and some be looking like they. But you gotta have the thighs. 
Yeah. To start. Save lives. You got to work on it. Yes to the commune. We're a community. See? Oh, look at this. <laughs> mm. Mm. It's the wink for me. Oh, wait. Hold on. We have merch. Let me show you the merch. Oh, my God. <laughs> I always miss the merch. I'll take the little vacay. Yeah, we need, we need less work, more time to... I just read the... <laughs> at the bottom it says and nigel we trust i wore this like in public one time and my mom my stepmom was like what's owens town and i was like my friend just started a cult <laughs> i know that's, right that's did me dirty and that's how you started it, it's a it's a cult i mean community <laughs> <laughs> i mean <laughs> Now that song sound is stuck in my head. The it's BBLs killing. <laughs> I hate it. BBLs. <laughs> yes. Well, ladies and gentlemen, enemies, lovers, assassins. We got to go. <laughs> lovers, assassins. Time to call it a night. Time for me to. Call it is. It's, it's bedtime. Yes. Oh, it is. Okay. No, 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 <laughs> y'all. Y'all keep going. It's late. <laughs> oh, yeah. It is 11 there for you. There are stickers. We have stickers. I have one on my bookshelf, and I have another one somewhere, actually. No, exactly. At least it's not to see where. I do have to be functional human being for craft or noon tomorrow, so I do not cut off my finger when I because I will be working on my book binding. <laughs> so I will be using sharp tools tomorrow. Oh, book binding. <sighs> yes. Proud of you. you I'm like, form, huh? Huh? You said you're tired of paying for them, huh? <laughs> I mean, I still am, but this. I did. Some of those books don't make sense. Why do I got to lick all the vaginas in the tri state area just so I can pay for the book? Huh? What? Break. Break. We Break. Break. I Break. a little bit. So, just so much, it'd be like fairy loot 10 grand American, a fucking American. It's it just gets on my why do I gotta search the high seat to fucking get a fuck? This is this fire is positive. This is private by the end of the night. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> Get out. But why do we got to fight? We're ancestors. This yes. is oh my God. Hi, Kayla. I was like, what? Where are we going? <laughs> it's the. Uh, Yes, they are. I have stabbed myself with this. Um, just to address everybody who who had a problem with me using the C the C word. word. Listen, Thank you. Thank you. Is, okay. No. You know that. I have to do a taste testing. Of the See, wow. They in the it's chat talking about commune community. merch. Yes, cult what? merch. You got it. Commune. Yeah, oh my god. There's so much. There's so much going on. Well, it's Bree, just is Ashley napping. <laughs> <laughs> she is sleeping. She is resting. She's in a long week. My thing okay. is. They ain't never trying to send me no book. You know how often I be wanting to get some black books. They don't never send it to me. And I'd be like, I run black a week for God's sake. And that they hurt. don't ever send it to me. You know, Kelly, that's a valid question. See you next Tuesday. I can be one. Bree, do you reach out to publishers directly? No. Or... They just supposed to reach out to you? Sometimes, but sometimes you can. Re I, re yeah, I, I feel reach like out to I've, them. I've been like recruited for shit randomly. And I'll just be like, all right. Oh man, it depends. 
I don't be reaching out enough because it's a cult, Elise's. Goddamn it! Okay. Don't you don't you do that? Yeah, and certain ones you just gotta because e- once you email them, then they at least have your email, your contact. But how do you know? Because y'all be coming out with I got reached out for this book box on Black Horror, and I'd be like, "Can these girls forgot about me?" I won't. I mean, I don't get that many books. The only thing also, I've gotten is like, oh, I can't even remember the name of the publisher, but it's like a very small publishing house. And then Harlequin um, added me to their influencer program. Yeah. yeah, some have influencer programs you can apply to. And then sometimes you can just go to the publisher imprint and find like their um, contact email and just yeah, email just them that way. Free, especially if it's horror related, since you have Black Lee and it's registered now. Yeah, so you would ask, like, ask them about a certain book, Black tell them about your social media, tell them about your Black Halloween. template for this? No, you just got to look at the website and see what they got. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Um, so also, you got to get started. Another, another plug, since, you know, we're heading towards the end of the year, Black Halloween is now officially a registered trademark. Yeah. Created by our our very own Bree. Breezy. Yeah, you gotta reach just some find the people you're reading from the most, like imprints, and reach out to them. And then oh, yeah, right. once you're on the list, then you'll be like, why are you sending me this? But then <laughs> then they'll just start sending you stuff. And I ain't gonna lie, Lala. I I'm, I don't call you Lala. That was weird. Kayla. Uh, I ain't gonna lie, Kayla. Um, I be thinking that you just be that girl and you be getting the books. I know you were reaching out. You couldn't tell me that in a voice note. Okay, great. <laughs> also, can we acknowledge Black Halloween, please? And how you're adding a new location this year. You know, I, I you know I get weird with okay. Well, fine, I'll do it. I'll be your recruitment chair as well. So Black Halloween takes place in October and is to celebrate black authors who write in crime fiction genres, mystery, thriller, horror, all that fun stuff, including cozy mystery. And Brie is adding a new location that caters to the romance girlies and honors her mama. So stay tuned for more information. It's gonna be great. I will get back to you on the post that I said I would create. I've just been busy with like wedding planning uh stuff. But I'll get back to you on that. But it's going to be really exciting. Black Queen's going to be great. She already turned it into a whole freaking town. And she's now adding another location. And there is a, basically with Black Queen and the town, you have a few years to try to become the grand searcher of Tulis Parish. And so there are various locations with different genres and you can just keep building on it year after year and your progress builds. She, if you are a patron of Breeze and the Secret Society, then you get a little mini round of Black Halloween. We just finished one and it's gonna be quarterly basically and you get to add more locations to your search and it helps you become grand searcher early. So. Join I know that's Patreon. right. Well, join, join Bree's Patreon. Ashley got a Patreon too. So I'm gonna need y'all to get y'all lives right. Okay, Ray, but uh, for real though. She's doing the announcement video this year. <laughs> <laughs> Put it to work. That was great. It won't that be was amazing. Me. Ray, you gotta pivot. <laughs> you do. You know what? Maybe that's it. Maybe that's what yeah. I need to do. Yeah, I agree. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. <laughs> I love it. Black Halloween. Yes. Well, shall we call it a night? I'm so excited to work on this yeah, tomorrow. <laughs> but that book was crazy. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. One more, one more Sorry. plug. So if you join Justice Patreon tomorrow, we have a craft afternoon with her and Mara. They have a podcast, but Jess is going to be book binding and you can do whatever you want during this rent. You can read, you can do whatever other hobbies you have. And then with Bree's Patreon, Secret Society, if you've ever wanted to like really get shit done, really be focused, <laughs> Bree be doing like three hours, friends, bro. I do. <laughs> the store, putting my groceries away, <laughs> meal planning, meal prepping, and get it all done in one sprint. You know, so, that's, that's, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. That's one sprint. The three hours, that's one sprint. sprint. That's just one sprint. <laughs> First off, 
Oh, well, you judging me, Jess? I do be in your sprints, be like, damn, that was two hours. I, <laughs> <laughs> like, like, I know. I'd be, you... like, I'd be spread the longest I spread recently was for 13 <laughs> hours. What? Yeah, for Black Queen, for mm -hmm. we did mini Black Queen, my patron. I yeah. spread it for 13 hours. You just <gasps> finished a mini Black Queen round. Yeah. Oh my God. But I yeah. sprint long because I like sprinting long. So that's that's on me. No, I've never been so productive as I have in a three hour sprint with Brie. Because you're going to get shit done. You're going to get it. You well. are going to get shit done. You got, <laughs> sure. you got it. I love it when somebody be like, just finish my book that I just started. I'll be like, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> She keeps it home. Because she works remotely. So she got the time. She'd be working on cases. She'd be having meetings. She'd be doing all the things. And then because she's doing all the things, you feel motivated to do all the things. Exactly. It works. I don't know what type of voodoo it is, but it works. <laughs> yeah. You get all the things done. Yeah, but uh, we usually do sprints on Mondays, and they could be anywhere between eight and nine hours. It's a great way to start the week for real. Just productive as hell. Wait, it's hard. Let's see. Before we go, well, Ray already shouted out Ashley's Patreon. Great sprints over there. Mm -hmm. Great sprints over there. Games. Game, game you night. Game nights in Ashley's. Love game night on Ashley's. Right on Patreon. Patreon. Not Patreon. Oh. Yes, join the <laughs> <Sprint> society. <laughs> yeah. And Ray doesn't have a Patreon. I don't. But she does have a channel with Mark Chronicles. She's also on TikTok, Instagram. I am. Yeah, she's she needs to give us more drunken reviews. Yeah, she does resets. Whoa. Love her Get resets, you. queen of brevity, Qu romance queen. I'm queen. trying to be like Ray. I'm like 15 minute timer, bitch. Wrap Listen, it up. my <laughs> 15 minutes or less. Damn it, I cannot edit more. <laughs> Listen, you're gonna get content. You're gonna get in and out. In yes. and out. Quick. In and out, and and it may be short, but it's it's meaty. Yeah. I aspire. I'm trying yeah. to get like Ray. Yeah. My vlogs, I'm sorry. They're not going to be 15. <laughs> if you are not already subscribed to one of these women here, you need to go in. That includes Robin because includes Robin, Robin has a quarterly series called Bookends where she tries to, tries to read down her shelves. It's not <laughs> always successful, but it's still a fun time. It's not, and, and sometimes footage get lost, but it's mm -hmm. a part of the- Robin rock. is always, always in her vlogging bag, too. I don't know how she be trying to be. Robin be in her vlogging bag for real, for real. Mm -hmm. Vlogging bag. Really? her Mormon bag? Vlogging bag. <laughs> vlogging. When, when did we become a Mormon? <laughs> <laughs> Mormon. You were like, I missed out. No, like, no way to the Mormons, y'all. I live. I won't say I love mm. y'all because me and religion ain't really friends. Yeah. But live it up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> John Smith, live it up. But my situation is, I thought the Mormon in was just really shocking. It's not she. It's not she. <laughs> I gotta, uh, I gotta get back on Robin because she got a video that she ain't edited, and so on Fridays, which is typically her upload day, I'd be looking for her, and she don't be there. It's not like I don't talk to her every day. That's not the point. It's like you know, a surprise. Yeah, the week, the week just slipped by. Yeah, and yes, you just yes. love a booktuber with humor. Robin gotta be that girl because she's the funniest. Fun girl, I guess. <laughs> Effortlessly, I love when you describe a book, man. It is good shit. It is good shit. And I know mm -hmm. Ashley done already went to bed, but you yeah. can find her at Bookish Realm and Realm of Comics. So I know that's right. Hey. Hey. If you are a comic book manga girly, then you need she to subscribe to Realm me. of Comics as well. She <laughs> she also does a lot of books. So if you have little ones or younger siblings, whatever the case may be, she's been in youth librarian. So she has all the rights for that on her TikTok too. She's been talking a lot about picture books. So yeah. 
She she the reason why book discussions are so popular on this yes. channel. And and it was uh, National Library Week, so she did a ton of content for that. So that's a great video. We love our librarians. Yes, yes, she's and our librarians. librarians. Critical yeah. thinking. A lot of y'all and us lack. Um, but she's good at it. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of good discussions. <laughs> 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 Well, yes. I'm gonna lie. Y'all ever see a popular TikTok and then you go into the comments and you be like, we have lost the plot. Yes. All the time. Yes. How did we lose the plot? Yes. It's been gone. It's it's uh I get worried sometimes. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. The plot is lost. Mm -hmm. It's in the mm -hmm. garbage can. People uh yeah, it's it's rough out here. I don't yes. even get how it works. Yeah. So bottom AKA, line is subscribe, subscribe to, to everyone. <laughs> subscribe to everyone on the YouTube. Join <laughs> Jess's, Bree's, and Ashley's Patreons. And um, I mean, that's really all there is because if you don't, you're anti-Black. So <gasps> Oh my God. I'm going to be back on my Zoom now that I have time. I have a Hold lot on. of that now that ideas. Since, since Jess decided to become unemployed, the Patreon content has been top tier. Yeah. Also, you can join my Monday sprints. What are you Monday doing? Monday sprints. You going to get shit done. Yeah. You really are. You really are. You feel just have to take Nigel to the vet. But even when I do long sprints <laughs> on the weekend, I still feel productive. I like when people be like, I got an event I'm going to. I'll come back if y'all still here. And we still, and then, we, we still okay. here. Yes. <laughs> I love that. Well, children, thank you for joining me to celebrate. Have a wonderful night. These friends might stay up. It wasn't terrible. No, we, we had some... There were some. I said, Keep on. We've had worse. There was some lot. Yeah, unless YouTube like flags it. This, this, Wait, I think there'll be a replay. It probably was me, huh? <laughs> not, 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 you. not you. Usually. <laughs> the children, all the children have been left the behind. The children have been left behind. It's so sad. Thank you all. Thank oh, you. yes. Send that to. Because Brie got to get them books. Let the mm -hmm. publishers know. I'm going to have to research it and figure it out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We got to get you some sponsorships or something. Yes, it's the perfect time to start. So, like, for Black Awena fans. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to do that. Oh, I should have. Well, okay, but Brie, let's not discount the things that you have done. Because Libro had that, the recommendations list, right? Oh yeah, that is true. That was really good. So you've oh, had some thank you. Stuff. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Good night, Toodaloo. Good night. Bye, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Wanted to call.